Welcome to Zero Page Homebrew, your best source for the newest Atari games, and I have a co-host! Yay, Yay! James, and who knows? I don't know, I'll have to put the name back. <laughs> Finally have a co-host. Yeah, Yay. and Atari, oh, he's so excited for treats. Yeah, as soon he's as I start, treats. start playing the chiptune music, they get all they excited. Get so excited. Today yep. is a 7800 Yay. day. Let's get that out without knocking anything Ooh, over. Oh, you didn't knock them over. That's fantastic. Hundred. That Twitch. Yes. Host Green, number host two. Host number two. Host name. Yeah. <laughs> Insert name here. Host name. It's whoever. Yeah. Cat. Human. <laughs> yes. Could be anyone. Uh, today we're going to be playing three Atari 7800 games mm. updates to games we've played before. Huge updates. Yes. They're all almost all done. Oh um, Stone Age. Drone Patrol and Night Guy in Another Castle. Woo! So, um, I don't know if you've played Stone Age or I Drone Patrol. I don't recognize either of those names. Yeah, so, so be yeah. Uh, new I'm stuff. I'm excited. Whose cute shirt? Not mine, of course. Yeah. It's hers. Yeah, you the got that. face? Got that pretty recently. Digital I did. kitty. It's a digital, a crazy digital black kitty. Yeah. It could be this guy. It, it could be. It, it could, could be, be Sprite. Sprite. Yes. Yeah. Or at least inspired by Sprite. Yeah. Tanya's feeling better now. I'm feeling much better today. Yeah, yes. I had well a, I had a pretty rough Tuesday. Yeah, but and, she's better. Uh, I'm 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 better today. I'm back on Friday. Hooray! Uh, oh, oh, it, it could it's be similar. Yeah, those it, eyes are very, very similar. Very similar. Yeah, too. I think it's generic black cat, but Gigi <laughs> works too. Because <laughs> they're round eyes, so they could be Sprite. Yeah, or Gigi. Yeah. Um, I want to thank the Twitch subscribers who help support the show. Eight <clears> bit <throat> poet Alan Defer, Andrew Atari, Atari 1974, Atari Beef Supreme Beer, Poco, Bruno Stex, Justin Mount, Charles Willen, Chitla, Crypto Coffee, Cubanismo, Sierra Rebo, Dianoid, Dan of VC, Daryl 1970, DMX, Dara, Drexel, Dr. Mook, Hazemi, Damn, Gamer, Composer, Gang, Soft, Great Defender, Ground Trooper, John UWC, Computer, Kenzo, Carl G, Karakak, Fun Dick Express. Better if you do it fast. <laughs> like as fast as I'm saying. Uh, Machine Gex, Markianis, Mark Spacing, Metal Atari, Mick Muse, Mike Sol, Michael Tell, Miss Command, MK Smith, Mother 3, Mr. Fix, Neo Media, Nostalgic, Pseudographics, Koa, Garantuitz, Renegos, Relentless, Fiji, Revan, Tulu, Ricardo, Pim, Rod, Casser, Smitty, B, Spice, Wars, Spinley, Esther, Mirrors, Stage 1, Boss, Tiki, Tanke, Tiki, Foes, Trek, M, M, D, uh, Tweeny, Vexrex, VR, Gamer for Life, VVG, Double Down, X, Ken X, and mm? just before the show, Pseudographics, Yay, Atarius thank Maximus, you. and Ground Trooper resubscribed. Thank, thank you so much for supporting mm -hmm. the show. If you would like to do that too and get your name mm -hmm. read out and scrolling beside Tanya, okay. just hit subscribe. It's free okay. with Amazon Prime, Woo. not free without it. Or you can just follow us and then you'll know when we're on the air. Yeah. Playing games. Yeah. New games <laughs> for old systems. Mm -hmm. um, so I have a poll question. <laughs> Tanya likes it I can see the I can see the question before it's on the screen. I'll start that poll up. Excellent. How many pets is too many pets? Oh. We have two kitties, and we've had two kitties for quite a while. Mm -hmm. There's no secondary. Uh, Im there is no such thing as too many pets. There <laughs> well, should be a six. There is no such thing as too <laughs> no many pets. No such thing. No such. Yeah. Thing. Um, or <laughs> yeah. So the answers that you can pick one. <laughs> For one, two for two, three for three, four for four, uh, or uh, uh, when they outnumber the people in the house, <laughs> and that's our cutoff. We have two people in the house, and there's two kitties. Because mm -hmm. if we got a third cat, then we they'd start they'd start plotting. Yeah, and and we wouldn't be able to fight them off if whatever they wanted. <laughs> They would have to get right. <laughs> but Toko <laughs> clearly not a pet fan. <laughs> one. <laughs> One's too many. <laughs> one one pet is too many pets. So zero pets for Vitoko. Yeah. <laughs> Some people, you know, they don't want pets. That's that's fine. Perfectly you know, fine. they they are a bit of responsibility. Yeah. You can't just leave them at home for days unless you have a lot of automated stuff. You can get automated pet feeders. You can. They can get messy. They can break. <laughs> I'd be I'd be very worried. I'd also have to have a camera pointing at the yeah. Yeah. At, at the feeder i would probably want that too just to yeah, make sure it's too it's too scary too many people in the apartment not enough space for pets yes exactly oh uh, yes no that's it's space it is space sometimes too dogs it? you got to walk cats you got to clean up their litter box they can be stinky yeah they can be demanding yeah they can get very costly mm -hmm. when they get sick oh look at him tilting can. his head he's yeah. so cute yeah <laughs> 
Um, but they give you a lot of love yeah. and companionship. And these guys are very cute. And he's tilting his head as I talk to <laughs> him. He? Yeah. He's like, when is the treats? Yeah. When are the treats coming? Oh, sweet cats. Um, goldfish, you can have a lot of goldfish. You could have like a hundred goldfish. Could, I've never been comfortable with fish. It just seems really? like such a small room amount of room for for a fish for the size what if of you had a, what if you had a pond a nice big pond that they could that'd swim. be a lot better yeah you'd yeah. be okay with a fish like pond. your parents have a pond they do have a pond it's not that big yeah the and, koi seem pretty happy in and it, it's so. uh pretty much like shooting fish in a barrel for local wildlife well they they've they've had things <laughs> like storks i think storks were they saying there's a there was a, a stork? stork not wow. a stork no yeah, a stork in their yeah. neighborhood that would touch down and eat all the fish and all the little ponds people had in their backyards. Oh, boy. Yeah. Well, stork are very good at uh, catching fish. They yeah. have the long, pointy beaks. Yeah. Just spear them. I think it was a stork. Something. Some local local large bird was eating all the fishes. That'll so. do it. Yeah. yeah. Or cats, neighborhood cats. Raccoons. Yeah. Oh, baby. No, don't break my heart. You see what he's doing? It's like... Can you give me something? <laughs> That's his oh, sign language for feeding. Oh my me. goodness! Yeah. Um. I. Uh. Into the news. Yeah. Uh. Oh. I don't have the um graphics set up for the cartridges. I'll do that in a bit. I don't know how I, how I missed this for laugh show. Mm -hmm. But I ran across this John Van Ryzen, mm -hmm. the uh person who made Hero, which I have right here. That's gonna be a mess if I do that with one hand. Um, Hero for Activision. Yeah. Uh, made a game mm -hmm. recently, a new game for the Atari 2600 called Alien Abduction. Mm -hmm. Hero adjacent, you're flying around, you're zapping things. Here's Hero, Very nice. which you made for Activision. Uh, he made uh, a new game. Oh, let's get off the screen. Uh, call it Alien Abduction. Very fun. Almost finished it. I was mm -hmm. on level 20 and there's 20 levels and I died. Um, he posted on February 23rd, just gave my Atari 2600 alien abduction source code and publishing rights to Audacity. Mm. And Audacity is the new Activision for 2600, oh, nice. right? Okay, yeah. So it comes full circle again. Um, so I haven't heard anything past that. Okay. Um, so I, there's no dates, there's no announcement from Audacity that I've heard. But, um, so this is for the physical release, I'm guessing, um, because it has already been released on the VCS for a download. Um, so, uh, looking forward to getting that on cartridge in the future. Cool. Um, so that'll be the first non-core of three of David Crane and the Kitchen Brothers. Mm. Uh, <clears throat> it'll be John Van Ryzen as well. Nice, we'll see nice. who comes out first. Is it going to be, um... Casey's Gold, or is it going to be Alien Abduction? Oh, yeah, there you go. The race is on the race for is that on. one. Um, I think that's all the news. I have some some things to talk about as we play the game. Okay, so okay. Just to remind some me. Some topics. Some to, topics, Okay, yep. fair enough. Um, but I'll talk about this one. Um, mm. If people don't know, I have been making a game. I can, been, I can you've seen say it. I've seen it. it say anything. It, I'm not saying what it is, but it... <laughs> quasi works so it's it's making it's on its way it's on its way yeah yeah um, it's for it's the 2600 stuff. i've started yeah. programming mm -hmm. started programming a couple of weeks ago being mm -hmm. terribly mysterious I see. <laughs> yes very mysterious i don't want to give it away because i want to reveal you it want on to the reveal show. it yeah you know and you'll reveal a, a work in progress version right like oh, yeah. you won't wait till the end end so no i've set a kind of a, a goal post it yeah. has to be complete to a point and like, then you'll show it like off. playable like okay. you can you can get scores you like you can progress in the game but there's things that i've i've done uh i've actually i'll show i'll show everyone because you can follow along uh with my progression if you want um make this are you are you being mysterious in your pro progression though uh kind of have to be <laughs> Because I don't want to give it away yeah. of what what it is like the game. Okay. A hero. It's not her. It's not hero. <laughs> <laughs> um, so it is codenamed One Liner, mm. um, just to give it a name. Mm. So I don't game one. It's better than just saying game one. Um, so I've got here what I have left to do. Mm -hmm. um, oh, the challenges. 
that are going to be difficult for me that I think are difficult. Okay. That it's an asymmetrical play field, okay. which is harder to program on a 2600 because you have to do a lot more. Yeah. Because displaying on a 2600 is in real time. Mm. So you have to change things while it's drawing mm -hmm. and time it all up. So that's challenging, but I've mostly conquered that, but it also cuts down on the amount of things I can do. What's the most challenging thing uh, for you making so far is the asymmetrical play field. It mm. took a while to get the timing right um, for not only the play field, because you're drawing, you're drawing, and I have an asymmetrical play field, which means it's different on the left than it is on the right. Mm. So while it's drawn, you have to update the play field on the right while it's drawing the left. But I got that done. Oh, good. Yeah. And also doing... Thank you for resubscribing, Yay, S. Ramirez. Thank you, S. Ramirez. 56 months. Oh, my God. When it gets to 100, I'm just going to be like, I don't understand that anymore. Even 56, <laughs> I don't understand. Uh, nice. Uh, no, I'm doing no no DPC, um, just straight bare board, I guess. Uh, mm. Bare metal, <laughs> I guess. So with what the kids call it nowadays. Um, um, and doing a 4K um, cartridge. Mm. Cartridge. Um, but yeah, the asymmetrical playfield is the most was the most challenging. I'm done. I'm past that. Now it's on to log a lot of logic. Yeah. Before I have to return to messing around with the kernels. Um, Flickr code. Uh, I want to put in. Well, I will put in, but that's an optional thing. Mm -hmm. That's going to be challenging, but not too challenging. Um, so things to do: advanced enemy movement, uh, variable player enemy speed. Right now, it just they move at one speed, yeah, uh, which is not a game. It won't get faster and harder. I have to do collisions. I have to do play field modification because it's not a static play field. It changes. Oh my goodness. You okay? Yep. Yep. <laughs> I have to animate the player and the enemy. Right now they're just, you know, they're just static, <laughs> static characters. So I have the hiccups. <laughs> Static characters moving around, yeah, floating. They don't know. have full animation yet. No. no, I have to add in scoring. I have to add in sound. Still a lot to do. Then. And then at that point, I will reveal it. Okay. Because yeah. uh, optional things, better enemy graphics and color. Yeah. Color requires more timing because you have to change color as you draw. Who I don't know if I have time for that. Adding in the flicker code. Uh, the game start, game over, just won't have anything on the screen to start the game. Uh, and a title screen and an attract screen. So this nice. is what I've done so far. Nice. This, I just did a tiny bit today. Yeah. I corrected the play field colors as I talked about yes. to you. Yes, yeah, yeah. You were showing me. Because she said, yeah. that's not right. And I went, no, it's not right. <laughs> I didn't and say I, that. I corrected, <laughs> I corrected it today. Uh, finished the play field. The whole play area is mm. done now. Mm. Almost, you know, 99%. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Basic asymmetric play field, basic enemy movement, player movement. You can control the player now. Mm -hmm. uh, enemy and player graphics, basic kernel pseudocode. And I, I date them all. So, yeah, and you can follow along with this uh, if you want in the Atari Age forums. It's coming along well. Yeah, um, and my cool. goal is to very get cool. it on the show before the end of the month, and I think <laughs> I'm right on track, if yeah. not ahead of track. So when you when you reveal it on the show, mm -hmm. are you allowed to be here? Like, can it be <laughs> me and Darcy, and we review your game? So you I can go. Outside you hall? can go through the anxious, <laughs> uh, the anxiety, like and the fear oh, that all these I lovely people whose like games we play <laughs> for the first time, and That's you can right. just be screaming at us from the other <laughs> exclusive world premiere. It's just me. And Darcy and James so have, screaming in the so other I, room. So I have to watch it on Twitch. Carl G likes that idea. <laughs> so I have to watch. We it have on to Twitch? watch it on Twitch. I'll be upstairs. <laughs> yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> but I'll let you play it first, oh. so you can break it. And okay. I do like put to put Yamo on the moon. Yamo on the moon. <laughs> yeah, right. Yamo on the moon. Um. <laughs> uh, okay. So uh, it's time to get right into the games. That's it for that's it for news. Yes, he needs to feel that <laughs> deep fear too if he's going to be a dev. That uh. fear of failure. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, you'll just you'll just have the chat. You you can just communicate through the chat. No, no, don't do no, it that way. No, you're doing it wrong. Ah, flip the switch. Uh. Uh, it is couch compliant. 
It has a steady oh, 262 nice. lines. Nice, nice. There's not going to be any screen flipping. Yeah. I always test it on developer mode. Okay. Yeah, it's couch compliant. You need to put that and stamp it on the whatever the that that start or track screen is. That's right, couch compliant. Boom. People have couch people have yeah. made the graphics, so I know it's, they've it's put completely it on the, doable. On their boxes, so. Yeah. You have them on the moon is the new Shaco in the walls phone. Yeah. You could have him on the phone just like other developers. <laughs> well just have him Skype in. Skype in from from the bedroom. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh. You can interview me. Yeah. yeah. I can interview you. Uh, break if scan. No, I, I don't need that. I can see it on the screen. I don't, I don't need the break if. Um, <laughs> okay. Um, so let's get to the first game. It is Stone Age. 7800 still on? Good. It's nice and warmed up. Mm. Stone Age by Anthony Quinlan, who's 2600, and then the Atari Age. Uh, forums and graphics by Constantinos Giamaldis. Um, we have played this before, but the last time we played was December 8th. 2023 and i don't think you have played it mm. and uh, 2023 well that's not that long ago not too long ago it's like three yeah. months Ooh. it is a port of this oh this tabletop game caveman ah very nice uh they've renamed it to stone age mm. and give it a nice upgrade actually as well yeah looks like it needs a dusting too <laughs> there's lots of dust up there, there i blame the cats yeah, yeah it all i'm cats covered very, in cat fluff right now cats are very dusty all you have to do is hug an atari and you just Oof, any boy. black clothing is not black yeah. anymore <sighs> So here you go. Thank you. Let me switch over to that right now. And uh, let me change the cartridge. But you can uh, go into Stone Age. I'll load up the cartridge graphic. Oh, too early? No, we're good. We're good. Nice. Yeah, Nostalgic says, my cats have been shedding like crazy. They know spring is coming. Yeah. This little black guy, this little black fluffy cat. Yep. He's, he's, he's gotten this gray poof behind his ears, which I think is all winter fur. Yeah, he might so, lose it. So I'm just waiting for it all just to go and just shed all over the house. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Little, little gray poofs behind the ears. <laughs> On dusting days, if I shine a flashlight at my air purifier, yeah. I can see the kitty floof dancing in the air intake. Yeah. Oh, yes, cat ballerina. Stone Age. So he's cooking Ooh, dinner. Look at that. Very nice intro screen nice. or title screen. Yeah. So it's different um, levels of difficulty. Amateur and pro. I think amateur there's pro. two. I just see amateur and pro. Okay. Amateur it is. Sure. I'll do the pro. And I think it's the B button for some reason. Ah. Oh. So. Oh, okay. The, so um, you, you only have three of those. What? You have to go back to your hut to get more. There you go. Okay. So avoid the fireballs coming down from the what is volcano. This? What am I doing here? You have to go collect the eggs from the dinosaur and oh, bring them back. Them. Now to get the eggs. Oh. Oh. Oh, I don't know how you avoid that. Oh. Uh, that's a new one. Okay, you have to stun the dinosaur with your with your um hatchet. And bring it back to And the... bring it back to your hut. And each level is six eggs. Okay. Now, don't... Oh! Oh, no, no. <laughs> oh I like that. Yeah. <laughs> this game looks like a Lynx game, Cat, Cat Ball Arena says. Yeah. So it's... Which one is it? And you move a little bit slower carrying the egg. Pro tip, don't get eaten by the T-Rex. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. That's pretty Double awesome. Double down. That makes a lot of sense. So... So, um... It's Let's kind of just go through. dodge and not get eaten. Is that sort of the idea? Yes, but in okay. the later levels, there's pterodactyls you'll have to shoot out of the sky because they'll steal your eggs. Uh, so let's go through the updates, uh, starting with uh, December 9th. Yeah, it gets, gets. Oh, it got oh, me. Oh, almost. Okay, I get it. Hey, I get it. Hey, buddy. Uh, December 9th, 2023. Uh, graphics update to the egg stash and the caveman with the egg sprites. Mm -hmm. Uh, move to a Banks set scheme. Oh, I didn't hit the right button. <laughs> and a bug fix. Player can knock out the T-Rex at the same time as triggering the TX eating routine. So I did trigger that last time I played. Oh. So they fixed that. Leave Totoro alone. On December 14th, uh, pterodactyl sprites revised and small changes to the background. Volcano looks absolutely stunning now. It's beautiful. Hey! Hey! 
Leave him. No. No. Come here. Come down here. Um, updated the pterodactyl fly intelligence routine and the death routine. A uh, volcanic rock tracking issue fixed. Oh, I can't move. Oh, what happened? I couldn't move. Oh, bug. <laughs> Dad, you found a new bug. He was, oh, what he did was you do? pooping out his egg, or yes. she, I should say. She. Um, and I, I, I shot shot her i yep. should say um and were you like really close like that i was really close before the egg had dropped and then i, I froze i couldn't move back oh, and forth the and then she ate me so something kind of just similar bug to that was what was fixed before okay. so you found a very edge case yeah i think i think i was right on the edge yep yeah so it's you're like in between two things where you can shoot but also they can get you. Yeah. It's like both things happen at the same time. Right, oh. as, right as she was laying the egg, egg didn't move. Oh. Yeah, the egg stopped moving and then I couldn't move. Yeah. I'm not very good at this game. It's cute though. <laughs> oh yeah. I'm enjoying it. <laughs> oh, I think they made the B button start because A is shoot and you could die. And that's what you uh, usually press, okay. right? So that makes a lot of sense. It does. Atari. Come on, you. He's like, I will chew all the cords in the house if you don't give me treats. <laughs> all of them. Starting with the laptop one, which is $60. He knows the most he expensive knows. cables. He, he understands. He goes, mmm, this one tastes expensive. Yeah. You come out of there. Nope. Uh, January 20th, background tiles revamped. A volcano sprite revamped. I can see it there. It's beautiful. It's like it's six, six um, different animations, six graphics for animations. Now the 7800 will officially have a better looking caveman than the NES. Uh, lava splat on caveman's head. Uh, egg stack changes. Yeah, now they're kind of uh, behind each other. Before I think they were just completely stacked on top of each other. Um, pterodactyl logic. Mama T Rex continues movement during level intermission screen. Ooh, intermission screen. <clears throat> Those are Apple level prices. Yeah, I wish there was different parts to this cable. Kittens. Oh my god. Cats, calm down. Uh, February 25th. Mama T Rex idle sprites revised. Mama T Rex eating sprites revised. T Rex egg knockback sprite revised. Pterodactyl sprites revised. Pterodactyl knockout sprites revised. Baby dino hatch and running. I think yeah. you maybe have to go back to your hut because I saw that the uh, baby didn't make it all the way to the hut when it went to the left. Does it go to the hut? I can't jump over it or anything. No, so. no, no. Uh, eggs partially hidden within the cave. Uh, yes, uh -huh. yeah. Yeah. Before they were completely exposed. Is this game written in basic? Almost all 7800 games are written in basic. I think there's only a brave few that uh, write in assembly. He's chewing his tail. He, he really wants... He really <laughs> I'm sure wants somebody will give you treats soon enough, yeah. little kitten. Uh, graphics packing for the code, sprite alignments for graphics packing optimization, some cleanup of redundant code, and routine flow. Uh, and this last update, uh, March 6th, baby dino running sprites, baby dino laughing sprites. Nice. Did he laugh at you when you uh, died? I can't remember. Oh. <clears throat> Oof. Now it's really coming down. Oh, yeah. Now, just to let you know, if you stand in the middle, yeah, uh, it'll take shorter amount of time for the um, volcano b lava balls. <laughs> oh, because because it comes down. Fast. Oh, you'll have to shoot upward. Just press the button there. Oh, he's gonna steal your egg. Stole <gasps> he your steals egg. that egg. Yes, oh. that egg. Oh, come on. <laughs> so you have to shoot a little bit before he gets to you because the. Yeah. Okay. Oh, you shot the lava. Now, there you go. Nice. Nice animation. Oh, he stays there, too. Uh, egg idle, then pulsates, it, pulsates then when ready to hatch. Baby, baby dino chasing caveman routine. Baby dino laughs when caveman retreats. For every two levels, you can get an extra life. Oh, okay. 
Bug fix, incorrect frame removed, and knockback time. Lava, oh, he's coming. Oh, I didn't have one. Ah. Uh, uh, stay in your cave. Oh, he laughs at you. He's coming to get it. Oh, no, he doesn't oh. when you're in your cave. Interesting. Okay. Okay. Lava splat skipped when bitten by baby dino. There's so much character in the game. It's yeah. so cute. It's so cute. TIX really like Tix did such an amazing job with the graphics. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, and you're on fire. <laughs> oh. Okay. It's very, very cute. It's very, very well done. super cute. Yeah. yeah. It's very... I, I, uh... And it, it, it's not a... It's a slow game. You know, it's... it's well, if you, if it's, you look, um, it gets hectic later. Oh, I'm sure it does, but it kind of starts at a nice pace to get you used to um, yeah, the movement it, and everything. Uh, the, the, the increase in difficulty mm. is, is, a, is very good. Mm -hmm. And that's how it is on the tabletop as well. And um, I, I didn't have that tabletop when I was a kid, but I had a friend who had that tabletop, so I played this game in the 80s. Mm. Good. <laughs> so mean stealing the eggs. Kittens. I've played it before, so I'm uh, playing on pro. Stop it, baby. <laughs> Demanding cats. There's so much character in this game. Yes, yes, this would have fit right in at, at the arcade in '83. Oh yes. One hundred percent. Definitely. got all the uh, elements mm -hmm. of silliness <laughs> that you would expect mm -hmm. from games in the 80s. Non-sensical stuff. And just cartoony too. The cartooniness yes. of the characters are really, really good. And and why not make them cartoony? Mm -hmm. Because, you know, it's you're not going to make them photorealistic, that's for sure. So, have fun with the characters. Hey, Crunchy the Clown. Hello, welcome. And Nostalgic says, what's the difference between amateur and pro? Are you playing pro or amateur? I am. I Is it don't faster? Have any I think notes. I think the uh, fireballs are definitely faster. They are. On amateur, it starts very slowly. So I think that might be the only difference. Like it's possible it starts with almost like a baby level, and then just sometimes it quite possible ha it has an easy level, an easy easy start level. But I didn't give the pterodactyls right away. No, and and I got the pterodactyls on level three. Three, yeah. yeah. I'm I'm guessing I'll have the pterodactyls as well on level three. Yeah. I find the lava coming down faster is actually easier. Because then you're not stuck well, you're, as long. Yeah, it's true. Yes, it's true. Yet yeah, you're not waiting for it. When you're on slow mode, you have to just sit there and wait and wait and wait yeah. and wait. So Capital I find, uh, Arena says the graphics artists for this really put their heart in. Yeah. Tix is absolutely an amazing graphics yeah. artist. Uh, highly in demand. Yes, yes. Um, look at look he, at that beautiful volcano in the background and like the T Rex with the uneven teeth and and everything looks so good and the big red nose on the caveman the animation oh yeah of everything the walking cycles on the on the caveman yeah and if you missed it when tanny got chomped by the t-rex that's awesome oh, the, yeah you have to get chomped at least once that's ah, definitely ah. oh no oh no he's gonna bite you nope shot him again i gotta get some more there we go. It's actually easier to shoot the uh, pterodactyl when uh, kittens. Oh, okay, I have to shoot this guy first. Yeah. When uh, you're closer to the hut, because it's not as high to mm -hmm. shoot. I mean, you can always shoot him when he's uh, in the air, like there. Mm. <gasps> oh mm. God! No! Ah! Did he steal one? Mm. <gasps> oh God! I gotta get out of here. Oh what? Oh, he's going to hatch now. Oh, yeah. you're not safe in your hut. No, you're not. From the lava. You are from the uh, the baby dino. Though. Yeah. I don't know if you lose points for missing the egg. I don't think so. It just makes it hectic. Yeah. It also You have to wait a long time until another egg comes, comes yeah. by, right? But there's no time limit, so that's not an issue. The pterodactyl, though, is is definitely has a 
timing as far as it coming at a frequent. Yes. And in the Very higher frequent. levels on the tabletop, there's two pterodactyls. It gets, really? It starts wow. getting okay, that can crazier get, and crazier. I can crazier. see how that gets really um, frantic after yeah, a Yeah, you have to start really working on the timing. As soon as you have the egg in there, then the pterodactyl comes. Oh, God. I'm going to have to do it really quick. It's always better to wait till the pterodactyl comes out. Oh, you can't go up that high. You literally cannot shoot it that high. Mm -mm. <gasps> you didn't have a shot. You only get three. Oh, no. I used them all up. You, you, you have to go Damn back it. to the hut. Yeah. I thought I had one more left. Yeah, because, uh, yeah, you can't, so you I have can't to shoot, shoot him high. on the way down. Ah, that's why I couldn't, I kept missing him yeah. when he was up at the top. But if you look, when you shoot it, it only goes so, so high. high. And it's just before the pterodactyl. Yeah, I had thought it wasn't hitting it because of the fireballs getting in the that's way. That's what but, I thought, too. But that's not actually what's going on. Oh. Ooh, that was close. Yeah, I don't think there's as much time in the higher levels, especially on pro, to... Uh, <laughs> I don't know if it's a coincidence, but the baby dino stopped where the pterodactyl had fallen. Maybe the dino just fed on it <laughs> instead of coming after you. Oh, uh, maybe. That's possible. God, God. Mm, I don't have any eggs to steal. You can do whatever you want. I'm actually surprised he even comes. <laughs> yeah, this, the stun time is getting shorter. Definitely. Oh, no pterodactyl yet. Yes. Oh, hmm. Interesting. Yeah. Oh, there he is. And you get him while you wait for the egg to come out. Yeah. But the lava can get to where the egg is as yeah. well. So you can't wait around there for too long. Well, you always have to move because of the... Uh, no, quick, no, no, quick, no, quick, no, quick, no, 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 no. And Good I think job. the pterodactyl speeds up as well eventually. That would make sense. So is this pretty much exactly like the... It's got all the elements. It, it's pretty much the same. You shoot... It nice. didn't have the baby dino in that, mm -hmm. in the uh, tabletop as far as I remember. Oh, the moon moved. Just a little bit across the screen. Ah, very aardvark-like. Yep. Oh. I to, yeah. to wait. You didn't have one anyway, so. <laughs> no, no, nothing, nothing to take. to steal. I'm going to wait for the pterodactyl. Oh, my God. I can't wait too long. <gasps> oh, I got him. Oh, my goodness. Oh, that was that close. That was lucky. That was really close timing. Just got him before he hatched. Yep. Oh, I thought it was almost too far away. Mm. Bernie yes. alert. Oh! Nope, Bernie's still there. Hasn't gotten Bernie yet. LCD was by Tomy. They made all the really iconic early ones. <laughs> um, still got Bernie? No? Does it say Tomy on it? It says Tandy. There Tandy. were different versions put out. Oh. So this is the Radio Shack edition oh. of it. Nice. Um... Made it to level six. Mm -hmm. Not super great. Mm -hmm. uh, I'll give you one more go and then I'll play once more again. Amateur? Yeah. <laughs> See how slow it goes? Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Way slower once you... Uh... I, I don't know if it's better. You have to wait such a long time between the, uh, the fireballs. So funny back then where... I guess it still happens to an extent where companies would rebrand computer systems and video games and sell it themselves like Sears did. Yeah, yeah. And Radio Shack well, did. Well, it was like they wanted it to be part of their brand. Yeah, they didn't want to but see, it wasn't... be seen selling somebody else's thing. Which is f so funny. Yeah. Um, but it happens now with, say, televisions. Nope. There's... Well, that's oh, way too early. too early. That egg oh, is slow. No. I think you can get it. No, no. Can't. Um... Like the panels that are used in televisions, mm. there's only a few companies that make panels, but um, almost all of the television manufacturers use the same panels. 
and it's just the different back-end software like the the smart tv stuff and the menu interface yeah it's true the options that are there uh, uh double down says well sears was one of the largest retail department stores in the u.s for a while the brand name meant something to people yeah it was so, huge huge yeah so it would be in the best interest of say atari to rebrand their um console mm. as telegames because of the huge reach of of sears right Whoa. Ooh, a couple pixels there yeah and <clears throat> same with radio shack they had they were known for selling computer stuff and components and batteries and all that kind of stuff not anymore they're just i don't know what they are now nothing almost non-existent it's like a couple stores left there's like almost no like computer stores left where's the egg it's nowhere he's he, she's working on it let's give her time or you broke it i think i broke it how did i break it you're good at oh, oh no, just that time. took a long she was, time she was building up to it yeah. tandy computers were really underrated well made and exceptionally priced I had a 1000 EX. Loved that computer. Oh. Our 2600 was a Sears Telegame 6 switch. Oh, nice. Was it a heavy one? What, did they make light sixers? Or just heavy sixers. I don't know. Uh, Atari's Maximus says we had an Atari branded 2600, but also a Sears branded Intellivision. Yeah, I have a Sears branded Intellivision. I don't have any Sears branded uh, Atari 2600s. I like the Atari look to them. The, the wood is very different. We were watching a video on it the other day. Yes. What, what did they call the wood? Uh, it was on the um, Sears? walnut. It has that walnut. kind of marbly kind of appearance to Rather it. Rather than the long striations mm -hmm. of the Atari. And also that metal background in the green telegames. I, I just like the, the sleek, the more sleekness of the black background behind the switches of the, of the Ataris. But some people really, really, really like the Sears versions. And I think it just like, oh, oh no, oh, egg gone. My finger slipped there for a second. Oh, oh no. ITC has a, oh. a Sears heavy six switch. Nice. I don't think Telegames had a heavy version, oh. but I could be wrong. No, I've seen, I've seen pictures and obviously ITC. Burlwood. 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 <laughs> Burlwood. Very fancy. Oh, and uh, I'm just going to switch. Oh, I didn't change the graphic. I loaded it up, but I didn't turn it on. There we go. Just a bit. It happens. Silly, silly, silly. It We're happens. not playing Jaguar today. Uh, let me load up the second game. Weird. Um, which is... No! Oh! Oh, oh, nice. Shooting. That was close. Third cartridge, so I don't have to deal with this. Doing better th this time? Yeah, yeah, but oh well, you learn yeah. as you go. <laughs> and that guy. Oh! Terrible. Meh. There we go. Okay. Um, so I don't know if anybody noticed, probably not, because it's very subtle, that I finally 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 fixed the sound issue with the intro yeah i don't know if anybody notices they probably think it that's the way it's supposed to be because it's never worked the intro plays this dun, 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 right mm -hmm. there's a small about one or one and a half second audio gap where it cuts out it drops out and then comes back that's not supposed to be there really yeah oh that's funny because you never heard it properly, right? Well, I always thought that's what it was supposed to sound like. I mean, it kind of goes... Oh! Oh, uh, it kind of goes didn't along... Did say game over? Hmm. I just went right to... Did I do that? You might have. Oh, well. Um, All right. It... It took... Like, it took me to now. Like, years. To, to realize... Find, not to realize. I know it's been broken this whole time. Really? To find that's the weird. fix for it. Okay. Oh, my God. It was impossible because nobody... 
expressed it how I describe it. Okay. The problem. Oh. Yeah, it was very VCR like. Uh, I yeah, was it liked was. It. Yeah, it was a you know a, I just an thought, audio. I thought that out. was complete. You should never have let anyone know that it wasn't completely <laughs> intentional. Well, it definitely was not. Um, it is what it OBS uses to play videos, mm. or you can use. There is another option. Oh my god, gotta get this guy. Kitten, leave the camera alone. Uh, it uses VLC to play video, or it can use VLC, and that's what I use, because you can do um, playlists. Um, so you can play one, two, three videos in a row. Um, there's a bug, not with VLC, but with OBS and VLC, mm. where it will cut out audio, and everybody reports it as it cutting out... Oh, I'm not paying attention. Mm -hmm. Ah, give it! No! Uh, cutting out audio at the end. I've never had problems cutting out audio at the end. <laughs> it was always the beginning. Um, so I found somebody talking about it cutting out audio at the end. Yeah. And I was like, okay, well, I'm going to try this solution, even yeah. though that's not the problem I have. And what the solution is to uninstall VL uh, VLC okay. and install an old version. Like it's on version three. Really? An older version of VLC? And you have VLC. to install version two. Uh, and I picked... and the. <laughs> newest version of version two is fine okay so yeah fixed it wow absolutely fixed it that's now, so weird but it, it's it the interaction with what obs right obs and vlc okay. there's some sort of so issue transferring the audio on on my and it's three different computer systems this one my old one i had before this and when we did the atari homebrew awards I had to manipulate the Atari, every video on the Atari Homebrew Awards to play no audio for the first two seconds because I knew about the bug. Mm. Uh, on one of them, I missed um, doing it. Mm. Um, so if you notice keen-eyed probably, people, probably yeah. nobody noticed. It's mm. just me because I'm very particular about these people things. People were more concerned with watching the nominees. So, <laughs> yeah. yeah, who won, who's who won? nominated, yeah, and all exactly. that. Yeah, exactly. Um, so that problem is solved. Um, That's I, so weird. I'll once in a while I'll probably try and install a new V a VLC. <clears throat> Version two is perfectly fine. Plays all my videos. It's not an issue. So um, that's not a problem. So that's years, years. This has been haunting me. Oh my god! And I solved it yesterday. Or was it today? How many years? Five years? <laughs> Six years? I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Wow. Four, five, six years, something That's like that. Crazy. Hi, sir. It's super crazy. I think these guys are are, are definitely going to need antsy. some treats. I think people might be waiting till. Um, oh no! When it'll when be you're after done. this game, yeah. These, but uh, Atari is is getting more and more frantic. I didn't know the seventy eight hundred was based on the Japanese. Well, twenty. Well, it's twenty eight called the twenty eight hundred over there. But yes, um, yeah, it is. Yeah, it looks exactly like the twenty eight hundred. Or very, very close. Mm. And uh, they just probably just went, eh, let's just use this. Looks different than the 2600. And the 2800's very quite, oh my god, quite rare because it did terrible in Japan. It's just too much competition there. Miss Delvue says, I'm not surprised by version incompatibility. For some programs I've done at work, I've had to change the version of a library I'm using in order to get things to play nice with each other. Yeah. Yeah, and I mean, it makes sense when you have two different programs and one of them you didn't even make, right? Let's say. Why did he run away? Why he is, is he running, running away? Probably because I'm over there. Maybe. Oh, he's too... He's, they're getting, he's like, mm, getting smart. I'm not going to go over there. You're waiting for me. Yeah. Ah, smart. Ooh, should I go for it? Ooh, yep. And there it comes out. So Good. you don't don't hide right in your hut. Hide near your hut. Yeah, he won't he won't try if you're right in your hut. Or that's a way to get rid of him too. You can go to your hut and he'll do a loop again. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's getting well, this is only level four. I made it to level six last time. Still have two guys left. I should have earned two extra lives from. Oh my god! He's gonna loop. Yep. But you're not safe there, though. But he, he doesn't have anything to get anyway. Oh, so. that's true. Yeah. Da little baby. Oh, he's so cute. He is so cute. That is so cute. 
<laughs> that would have been I a good um, add-on for the for the tabletop version. Right. Uh, but it's a it's a nice little addition. Mm -hmm. and that's I mean that's the great thing about making a game Get based on an nope. old. There you go. Uh, an older game, you can add things to it. Yeah. Add anything you want. Yeah. Update it's it. It's like a little. something you wanted to see in there. Tweak it a little. Yeah. Or, yeah, just make it a little bit harder, or a little bit different. Might as well put your own stamp on it. Yes, we know. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Oh my god. Is it dimming? Yeah, it just browned out a bit. Okay, um, that's not my eyes because that's still me browning out. out. It is browning out. It's kind of darker in here. That's weird. Mm. That's not a good sign. Nope. No, he stole my egg. I replaced it. Power issues. That's scary. I don't like that. Nope. <laughs> very bad. It's not a good sign. It's very, very bad. What are people saying? Okay, well, I've wondered how those old LCD laptop games were programmed. Um... I'm sure they're very, very similar to games that are on computer systems. You have to do logic, mm -hmm. if this, then. But there's less graphical things to do. Because the graphics are kind of hard coded into it, right? Like it, physically, the positioning. They're, is they're more about like move, lights, right? Yeah. Move this to this position. Yeah. Rather than, I mean, you still have to move graphics. Yeah. They're just chunkier, I guess you could say. Yeah chunkier graphics there's there's not as many positions to move but um i would think it's pretty much the same level of programming as any other uh game systems there's a lot of really creative ones i i used to be like eh, i'm not too interested in handhelds but then they bought some and now i oh no too late too give late. it no! no he's gonna come after you now oh god oh it's really tough now. it is really fast you have to kind of go in. So cute. <laughs> wait, wait for him nearby, then go in. Because if you go in too early, the hellfire comes <laughs> raining so, down. So Cat Ball Arena was saying, yes, it seems Sega's SG-1000, yeah. the 2800, and the Famicom were all released in 83 in Japan. That's Ooh. quite a bit different than how things went here. SG-1000 would be hard to compete with <laughs> Yeah. against the 2600. But that's a lot going, go, coming out one? at the same time. What was the third one? Uh, Sega 1000, 2800, yeah. and the Famicom. Yeah. It, like, that would have been an epic year uh, to yeah. be a kid who could afford They'd video game systems. They'd have to price the 2800 Consoles. really low to compete with yeah. the Famicom. Because the Famicom was just leaps and bounds. Oh, yeah. Ahead of so cool. the 2800. I love that whole thing they had in Japan with the discs. Where you yeah. could load games on a disc and bring it back. Oh. And, so and just cool. rewrite a new game on the disc. It's like, I'm bored of this game. I want a new game. It, 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 it's almost like they had a vending machine instead of a, like a... They did have a vending machine. It was a vending well, machine. Well, no, no, a vending machine in place of like a, a video game store. You know yes. what I mean? You'd go and rent a game. It's like, no, you just go to the vending machine and get your game. Well, I about, love that. Thinking about Japan, they do love their vending machines. They do. Well, they love the convenience. Like, it's make awesome. things convenient. It's, yeah. That's very when, cool. when we were there, there I was that idea. so many vending machines. Yeah, there, <laughs> they were, were. there were. Super cool. Yeah. And they loved little prizes inside vending machines, too, where Toys you put, and, put in yeah. the money and you turn it. And yeah, it. Oh, man. I want to go fun. back to Japan. And the, the yen. Arena, I would have been hovering around the kiosk like a bee. Yes. And the yen is oh. very favorable right now. Oh, haha. Ha. Are we going back to Japan? Is that what you're saying? Next year. Next year. Oh, okay. <laughs> if it holds. No. Oh, Trumpy Chomps. Oh, oh, no. That's a good Level way to end six. it. I, <laughs> that was I, had, good. I had no. Mm -hmm. <sighs> weapons left. You have to keep an eye on those weapons. Three yeah. is not a lot. No, and I was shooting pterodactyls and stuff really really good mm -hmm. oh my god what a fun game yeah. um i need to get better obviously but we'll play it again i think they're getting very close to, to finishing like their final it. version oh, yeah okay um because this is very fully featured mm -hmm. i mean there's a bug you found um where you got what was it you stunned him but you couldn't move yes i couldn't that, move that's what it was when the egg was coming out 
You shot coming when the egg down, was coming down. And I shot him, but then I couldn't move away. Yeah. And then, yeah. The fact you couldn't move away was the bug. It was yeah. the bug, yes. Yes, yes Atarius Maximus. Yeah. Great Fantastic. Game. Yep. So Looks can, amazing. So you can download that in the Atari Age <gasps> box. <gasps> They've been waiting. Thank you, Pseudographics. It's treat time. You've yum, made yum, two yum. Kitty's very, very happy. Okay. Oh, I feel like I haven't done this in so long. We haven't. Oh, there's a treat ball. Yeah, okay. I found it. Good. Where was it? Uh, it was under the couch. Oh, of course Obviously it was under the, the couch. One of the cats. Yeah. Don't run out. You're not getting fed upstairs. There's, there's no treats why, out there. Why? No, no. <laughs> You're so funny. I think he thinks he's getting fed, like upstairs or something. That's so funny. Okay, kittens. Let's get it going. Let's get everybody should have lots of um, lots of money to bet now. It's been a while. Oh yeah, it's been been uh, building up. Uh, yeah, if they've been watching all the oh, and the if you were watching the um, Hunger uh, Awards, you would have been gaining it because you couldn't you, you couldn't spend it during it. That's true. That's fair. Unless true. you did spend it and it didn't trigger anything, <laughs> that would have been a big mistake. Yeah, I think I have to turn the brightness on the camera up a bit. A little bit dark. I mean, it looks I think, good. I think that is the camera. Yeah, because because you would have... It is a little... I noticed that, too. Okay, kitten. And also, the lights are going a little wonky, too. I'm not sure what's up with that. Yes? Did it start? Yep. Okay. Place your bets. Place your bets. Place your bets Place on your the cats. cats. We've got two cats here. Yes, we do. We've got a Sprite in this corner. We've got an Atari in this corner. And they're both very eager for treats. Yes. So I think this is going to be a very quick round. <laughs> Sprite is usually the uh, cat to bet on. Yeah. On uh, one or two, but sometimes he pulls off a three. Yeah. But Atari can hungry. come up from behind, and yep. he is hungry. He hasn't had he is hungry. a good treat time in a while. Did, did they Weeks. do treat time on Tuesday? No. Oh. No, they didn't. I disabled it. Oh, because that'll I was, be interesting. I was by myself. Let's they see were, how... Uh, they were very How upset. Hungry? How hungry are you for treats? Yeah, they would have been there the whole time. But it did, they did the uh, treat ball. Okay, well, that's so, good. They got yeah. some treats in the end, yeah. Oh, oh okay, okay. About 30 seconds left. A little bit on Sprite, and then a on uh, lot on Atari. A lot on Atari. Nice. Oh, they oh. believe in you. Yeah. Oh. You're a good kitty. Both of you are good kitties. Yep. Yeah. Still tons on Atari. And they, they still get the treats. So whoever you bet for, they still get their treats. 15 seconds Hi. left. Nothing on the three pluses. Yeah. Ooh. Well, that'd be interesting. Are people waiting for the three pluses? Maybe. Or are those going to go empty for the first time ever? Yeah. And we'll see what happens. Got about 10 seconds left. Oh, no. There's 10. 10 bet on three sprite three plus oh <gasps> there's nothing on atari three oh. it's not gonna happen but uh who so do we win in that case do the we house the house wins I the guess. house wins if it goes atari back to the plus. infinity pool uh, yeah <laughs> so that's what it is that's true that's true okay not gonna be a big payout if that wins okay okay are you ready cats are you ready are you ready are you ready, are you ready? so put them oh Oh. Gotta, gotta get the uh, oh yeah you gotta get on the screen get the scores oh up. there we go all right and get the score bettings up it's been a while reset the points zero zero okay on your sides get on your sides yeah okay. ready go oh oh atari's off atari the in the lead oh sprite that I was did, weak I but that. i i heard it i heard oh. it it was rather weak back to the twitch gods oh, oh atari is hungry and he's eating fast. Oh, oh, Sprite ties it up. 2-2. Two, two. Atari's looking at us rather than ringing the bell. Oh, no, you missed. Nope. There you go. And he's pretty strong with ringing. He's he's getting it pretty quick. Sprite's always pretty good with ringing. He's very soft, though. He's tied it up. It's 3-3. Three, three. It's neck and neck. If Atari keeps up this pace, he will win. Oh, another Atari ring. It distracted Sprite for a second, but he caught up. It's 4-4 four, four now. Oh, my goodness. Atari's eating them pretty fast. And he's ringing pretty strong. And he's missed it. Oh, that's an Atari. And it's a Sprite. It's 5-5. My five, goodness, five. it's neck Whoa. and neck. It Who's going to win? It is neck and neck. Oh, oh, and Atari keeps it up. He keeps being ahead from Sprite by just, just a whisker. Just a whisker, and it's sick. What are you tossing it over there? I it got it bounced. Sorry, sorry. Do you want to help him? Yeah, that is unfair. There you go. You can't throw it over there. And oh, another one for Atari. 
Eight seven for Atari. Sprite is a little bit behind because his treat got a little far and it's going away. What's happening? He's bouncing it, not me. <laughs> oh. Nope, oh, you, no, you have to hit the it. bell. Hit it. It's there game we go. point. It's Atari game point. Will he win? Will he win on his first time back doing the treat time? Sprite is Oh my it's goodness! Over ten. Oh eight. my goodness! Did he find it? He's chasing it. Oh, he's chasing a bug, actually. Oh, oh just no, it's over. It's oh. over. <laughs> okay, give them some. All right. Give them some extra treats. There you go. So he found a bug, and, and he got distracted. <laughs> <laughs> Atari by two whiskers, actually. Wow, Atari! Now you know. Now you know how to win the game. You you have to um, distract Sprite with bugs. With bugs. <laughs> I'm like, what is he going after over there? Yeah, he's eating his treat. Yeah. Okay, let's dole it wow. out. Atari one to two. He didn't quite make three, which would have been very. Would have been very. Nobody would have. Everyone won. would have lost. That would be terrible, actually. Tanya found a bug, and Sprite found a bug. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So that was the major bet. Very Most nice. Most people put it on Atari. They had a feeling. Yep. So Carl G and Atarius Maximus. Way oh, two go. people. Oh, yes. Wow. It must have been uh, a lot of people betting. Oh, no, what? Three on Sprite. Did I click the wrong one? Yeah. And then uh, two on Atari. Okay. Yeah, Congratulations there we go. to Carl G and Atarius Maximus. Nice. Yay, Atari. Exactly. Okay. Oh, God, I just closed my window. <laughs> you closed your window? Yeah. What window? The one I did not want to close. Oh no! What? What? In what sense? Oh, let me just. Oh, restore. that window. Restore tabs. Oh. Restore. Yeah. Before I forget. Okay. Good. And the chat for us. One second. Let me just set up my things I need. Oh, I see. Yeah. That small and sprite today was distracted. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. So let's get to the next game. Um, which is... Da, 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 da. <laughs> it is Drone Patrol Ooh. by Steve Englehart, Atarius Maximus, who is in the chat yeah. with us today. One so if you very have any well questions. today. Yeah. And uh, Jam did the music, mm. which is Hexaflight in the Atari Age forums. So let's switch back. And get the next game going. Grab your joystick. Grab my joystick. Ready. Hey, Triple J26 Fire. Welcome. Welcome. Thank you for watching. So this build is from today. Ooh. This so, one? No, that's what we just played. Uh, Drone Patrol. This is a 528K game. It's mm. very large. If you want to load it up. Uh, second one. This guy? Yep. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> Special intro very screen. Very pretty, very nice. <laughs> Thank you so much, Atarius Maximus, for that. It's gorgeous. And he's going to be posting uh, the source nice. code to this oh, nice. in the forums if okay. anybody else wants to use it for if they want to send over a special version for us to play oh, in the nice. show. Oh, nice. Yeah, yeah. For your game, well, wrong. <laughs> well, wrong system. Wrong system. I'd have to recreate it. You'd in have to recreate a different it. look to yes, it. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Have you played Atari today? Nice. Run. Great music. Reminds me of the guy from Load Runner. Yeah. Maximus Games. Oh, Maximus Games. 2024. Steve Englehart. Starfield. Oh, drone patrol. Nice. Okay, so there's uh, four different levels of difficulty. Mm -hmm. Oh, Marky, thank you. I will change that. Um, so you can enter passwords for cheats. You can. Um, so let's go to the mission briefing. 
Mission briefing. Our city is under attack. It's your job as commander of the city's drone patrol to destroy the invading infantry and mechanized vehicles and prevent the destruction of our city. Oh, spelling mistake. Destruction. Uh, avoid missiles. Uh, the enemy is unleashing a powerful counterattack with radar equipped cannons and heat seeking missiles in an effort to destroy our fleet of drones. We can't let that happen, Commander. Fire at will. Mm. So avoid those missiles and avoid the things shooting up at you. The cannons. So okay. Press the button. Yeah, great looking um, instruction cannons, screen. Radar equipped with cannons and heat seeking missiles. To the left, to the right, I mean. Nope. Oh. Back to the mission. Button. Weapons briefing. Use your left fire button to fire your laser and the right fire button to drop one of your three equipped smart bombs. You will receive only three per mission. Uh, as shown on your status bar, all visible member enemies are destroyed. Nice. So yep. That's your smart bomb. You get three. Watch your status bar uh, for your laser power at it, as it will discharge with use. When it reaches zero, a recharging drone will appear, making contact with the recharging drone to restore laser power. Okay. That's a recharging drone. It's very that one's very obvious. Uh, using your laser, you have unlimited laser recharges during your mission. But you see it goes down. The mm. laser this is great instructions. Interactive. Yeah. Laser can be fired for a limited amount of time, so don't hold it. Kind of do bursts. Um you will then need to release the trigger mechanism and re-engage to take another shot. The drone specialized laser weapon is powerful enough to destroy all known enemy invaders with mm -hmm. a single shot. Shields. Due to our advanced shielding technology, discrete direct, direct. hits will discrete. not discrete hits <laughs> will not cause the destruction of your drone, but a slow drain of the overall health of your drone shield. So you can mm. see the shield going down. Medical vehicle. Avoid shooting the medical vehicle, or you're in, in um, you'll get in trouble with uh, the uh, global powers that be. Uh, you're against enough. the yeah. uh, Geneva Convention and yeah. shooting things with. You can see it by the pluses, so yes. don't shoot those. Okay. It has a magnetic defense mechanism that will drain your shield's health, and if it is attacked. Okay. Oh, another spelling mistake. Oh, I missed that one. Yeah. Uh, mechanized vehicles. Oh, hey, thank you Charles for subscribing. Leland. Thirty-five months. Excellent. Welcome. Uh, there are three types of military vehicles you need to target with your laser attack. A missile transport. That one's very obvious. Yeah. A troop transport, which looks kind of like the medical. Uh, medicals. You have, you have to be to careful. Look for the that. pluses, yeah. Uh, the tank, very easy to determine. Missile transport, 50, 75, 100. Okay. Defeat as many possible as they traverse the city streets. I think if you miss them, it doesn't matter. Enemy soldiers. There are three types of enemy soldiers you need to target with your laser attack. They wear blue, yellow, and orange. They're all equally, they are all equally lethal. lethal. To destroy soldiers. Let's see, they have guns. That's you gotta watch for that. Okay. Okay, defeat as many possible. Okay, next. Uh bomber. Use evasive maneuvers to avoid the bombs as they fall towards the city. You cannot destroy the bomber. Okay. Progress just, bar. Just dodge. The Progress bombers. bar will show how close you are to the next mega drone. Okay. Difficulty levels. You may select your difficulty level uh, based on your experience. Uh, easy, one missile, a powerful drone, laser, slow enemies, no bomber, standard two missiles, advanced three missiles, expert. It's the ultimate challenge for the experienced pilot. Uh, power and enemy speed, weak laser. Okay. Just gets harder as you go. Oh, Tarius Maximus is taking notes. <laughs> okay, next. Did you wipe your hand on the side there again? I did. Bad. Yeah. Bad. Bad. Cat's, lick, licking, licking. cat's licking the couch where yeah. she wipes her hand on the couch. You wanna wipe Obviously, I need a new couch. Hand? You want to lick my hand instead? <laughs> mega drones and passwords. Intelligence suggests the existence of 10 mega drones. Each has unique and advanced weaponry. Ah. I think uh, every tire collection says he made it to level six Ooh. on easy. On easy, okay. Each has a unique advanced weaponry defenses. Their exact capabilities are unknown. Victory grants a full shield recharge. Oh, nice. That's good. That's quite, quite the enemy. After defeating a mega drone, you will be granted a secure password that can be used to continue gotcha. your mission from the exact same location. Okay, that makes sense. And because your shield is recharged after defeating it, it's, yeah. it's always going to be the same. It says one, three smart bombs per mission. Is this all one mission? I think... I would guess that each mega drone dictates the end of a mission. But it says continue your mission. Oh. I don't know. We'll see. Okay. 
Okay. That's page nine. So pick your skill level, probably Thank easy. You. Oh, credits. Thank you to everyone who has contributed to and supported the development of this game. Albert, Saxmeister, uh, CJ Her, I don't know that name. Slidelman, David Exton, Smitty B, Eagles, Esmeris2008, Hexaflight, Trevor, Carl G, TrekMD, Muddy Funster, Zero Page Homebrew, yay, Revenge, and the whole Atari Age community. Mm -hmm. Every single person. Mm -hmm. Great graphics there, the cityscape. Mm -hmm. Three, oh, it is just three smart bombs. Ooh. One whole playthrough. That's what so I was you've thinking. You've got to reserve them. Don't. For very end, I would think is. I'm gonna go standard. We'll see how hard standard is. Or he did. Uh, he did easy. Easy. Well, maybe we'll do easy. <laughs> he only made it to six. He's a good player, though. So. I know. So I would go easy. You have to go down to start. Nope, too far. Oh, Open. that. Oh, Not there. Start. Okay. Get ready. Get ready. So it has a Tari box. That's you descending to earth. There you go. Short bursts. I thought there were civilians, but I just couldn't see their weapons. Every guy running around. There's no, oh! don't shoot that guy! No, but I, I don't seem to hit anything here. You are. Am I? Well, you're They're on the not... wrong plane. You... Oh! Oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah, that yeah, would you have, explain. You have an aiming rectangle. I, I, I did not realize that's what was going on. There you go. What is that yellow thing? That's that shooting at you? you. Yep. Everything kills you. Everything. That's, that's a fair. A thing going across kills you. So just don't be above the thing that shoots at you. The only thing you don't want to shoot is the ones with the crosses on it. Okay, now go get some more lasers. There you go. Perfect. This really, really reminds me. It's in the same vein as um, the 2600 game Raptor. It's a, a similar feel where things are going across. Um, and oh! You... Do not shoot. Do not shoot. You only get your health back after defeating the big boss. Oh, yeah. Triple, triple J26 fire said that at the, the same time. Shoot first, I? ask questions later. Yeah. <laughs> About remind, reminding of Raptor. Raptor's an amazing game, and this is an amazing yes. game too. So this is a really great genre. Now, you don't have to get too crazy, because if you miss them... Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. oh, there you go. Stay in between. No, don't go to the side. Oh no, there is a There's gun a laser. in the middle. Oh my me. god. Ah! Careful. 73 hit points left. You'll get them back at the end. But... Ah! Oh my god. Wow. How do you get this guy? Oh, you dodge his things and shoot him on the sides. Definitely. Hang up, hang up. Ah! Oh, 58 left. Him or me? You. You have 100. He has 130. <sighs> Careful. You're not doing too bad. You can make it. Yeah, it's down to 106. You're fine as long as you don't fly too close to an airport. Okay. <laughs> With your drone. 39, you almost got him. 32. 26. 2. Woo! Nice. Congratulations, the Predator has been defeated. Here's your password. Nice. Difficulty, easy. Tip, shoot him on the sides. Pro tip. Yep. And you figured that out. Yep. Good stuff. Nice. Nice. Cap Arena says. <laughs> Level up. Health. Laser recharge. Press right fire to continue. Yep. The shields are at 100 now. Now that you've got the hang of it, you should be able to do it a little bit better. Do I have to kill everything or just as much? Oh, it only progresses when you kill things. No, but I, I mean, think. is it a certain point score that it's looking up? Ah! It must be related to points or just general items that you're shooting. Stay away from the yellow thing. I'm, I know. What did he say? You're, oh, get refueled. There you go. You're over halfway to the boss. 
things there. So Atarius Maximus, what determines... Oh, it's a oh, it's so close to the yellow thing. Yeah, but he doesn't necessarily hit you right away. No. Um, is it points or the number of things that you shoot? I'm guessing it's the number of things, because everything has a different point score. Uh, things on the side. Oh, it does, oh, it does, shoots things there, so you want to get it in the middle. Ah! Oh my god, oh my god! How do you avoid those? Ooh, ooh. Oh, I can't move fast enough! They don't hurt you too much, they're just trying to avoid as much as possible. Now, you don't have to worry about wasting your laser in this, just hold it down. No, it, it stops. Oh, okay, that's why. You can't hold it continuously. You'll get him. You'll get him if you keep doing what you're doing. Ugh. Are you pressing the wrong button? No, I, it, it, it does stop after a while. Almost got him. Kitten! Ah! Kittens Cat are, attack! Kittens are good Cat for that. Drone. Two more! Two more! Yeah! Oh, yep. Tarius Maximus. Yep. Yeah. Oh, level okay. progression is based on points. So you get if you go for the big points, the faster you'll get you'll to the get boss. You'll get to the end. Gotcha. Good stuff. Stay in the middle, move back and forth with the boss. Yep. I'll be back. I'll be back. <laughs> Kittens, calm. Calm. I'm asking for calm. So I'm guessing the big... Um, hi. Don't shoot that guy! Oh! That. The the people actually give you a lot of points. Oh, do they? If I remember from Because they're the, harder to get? I guess so. What is the most points, Atarius Maximus? I think it's the stuff on the bottom. Um, I don't think it's based on... No, because they're... It, oh, it's they're different. the color. Yeah. Oh, the color? Yes. It would be the stuff on the bottom, oh. then? <laughs> like, Wait, nothing's happening. Bottom row stuff. Okay, thanks, ITC. Yeah. Because it's harder to get... Yeah, you have to dodge a little bit more. Oh. Don't shoot it! <laughs> you lose your, you lose health. A little bit. You don't lose all of it. No, but you need it for the boss. You do. Soldier on the bottom of the screen yields the most points. Yes. So you want to go yeah. for that guy. The, okay. the soldiers definitely have a lot of points. It's worth so, going for Soldiers them. first. Hit. What oh was God. that? Did he hit the bell up he there? Did. It oh. doesn't. No, it doesn't count ringing the bell right now. You're a bad cat. Naughty naughties. Come here. You're naughty. You're a naughty cat. Maybe the target square should appear a bit smaller as you go back. Um, well, the ship doesn't change size, so. Oh. You've got a long focal length. Ah. 58. Not doing well. Still have enough to make it, but we're almost there. Just a little bit more. Laser is low. Come here. Come here. Where is he? <laughs> he comes back. There you go. Just Jeez. a couple more things. Makes sense the people are the Yay. ones that have the most points because they're harder to hit. The parallax is great. Oh, what's this guy about? Oh, where's your hit point? Ah! Oh, you've got 96. Oh, it fills your hit points. Oh, it doesn't matter then. Is it supposed to fill your hit points? Okay, there's, so there's moving guys, and that guy's got a center shot, but it's very short. Oh no, it goes right up to you. Okay. Oh. Those guys' shots are very slow, so it's not too bad to avoid. Oh, yes, you get a full set of shields before each boss. Okay, so you don't have to worry about having 
the shields going into the boss. Just as long as you may have enough shields to finish the level. That's good. You're gonna, you'll get him. You'll get him. Keep on track. Keep doing what you're doing. Can you shoot those other guys? No. No? Okay. Ah! ah don't move with it. <laughs> he moves way too fast. Tyrus Maximus says, The parallax scrolling is the only main part of the game done in assembly. It was created by M.K. Smith. Oh, awesome. Oh, of course. So the parallax code was done by M.K. Smith in general, or the code specifically, specifically for this game was done by M.K. Smith? So you should definitely be... Um, Get some. Yeah, level three. Woo! Um, be credited. I should. I should add him for the credit in the listings then. Yeah. <laughs> Stay on target. Parallax confuses me. Sometimes it looks like the vehicles are going in reverse. Mm. Oh, because you're moving the city. Oh, that's true. It's kind of just eye candy. <laughs> They're unrelated to the city, the a destroyed city below. Uh, when you get the guys, it's fairly disturbing. Oh, when they explode into blood? Like... Turn into pink mist. Uh, nice. Yes, the Parallax demo was created by M.K. Smith. He posted it as a demo. I adapted it for this game. Okay, so not specifically made for the game. Very cool, um... Very cool um, effect. It puts a very good use in this game. I think you've got the hang of this game now. Oh, right? yeah. <laughs> no, it's good. It's she hasn't cool. even used her super bomb. Oh, yeah. I forgot I had the super bomb. Can you use the super bombs on the big bosses? Or is it only good on this screen? Because it kind of implied it cleared the screen here, and it didn't say anything about the bosses. So I'm guessing you can't use them. And it doesn't even show up in the bosses, so like your bomb numbers. I'm guessing it doesn't have anything to do with the bombs. You mean that during the, the guy bosses. at the end? Yeah. yeah. Tire Maximus says yeah, no, it doesn't work on the bosses. Okay. Just here. So I guess if you want a bunch of points. Oh, you are playing on easy, so there's probably a lot more going on <laughs> in the difficult levels. Yes, that this is need, easy, yeah. That you would need the, the bombs for. Because I think that that red thing is supposed to shoot at you too, if I'm not mistaken. Something oh, like that. The, Did I the, read that in the synopsis? In the sky? Oh, yeah. I remember. This is easy. Yeah. Oof. We're almost there. <laughs> ITC, you only made it to boss six. Tanya's on level four. <laughs> this is wow. her first time ever playing it. <laughs> Are, I'm sure is, it gets harder. I'm sure the boss is Tanya an expert at this game, or? Uh... <laughs> Fucking shit, to IC ITC. <laughs> ah! Oh no, I said I took down eight bosses. Oh, never mind. Okay, <laughs> that's a little different. Tanya's got a way to go. I do. We might switch up so you can play for a bit too. Uh, no. I want to play on hard. Oh, you do? Yeah. Oh, okay. It's only got a... S oh, what? Oh, What's my God. What's the background there? there lights are... are oh, you have to dodge very slow-moving things. What oh, is, that's is hard. On? Can you see them? Yes, I okay. can see them, but... That's going to be challenging. It's very hard oh. to see it. Because there's bright lights in our eyes. And it's very dark gray on black. <laughs> The bomber does not appear on the easy difficulty level. Okay. Well, there's a clear path in the middle. Okay. Uh, not doing too bad, but he's getting, getting hurt. you. Uh. If you're really low on shield health and very close to a boss, that's when you should use a bomb. Right. Yes. That makes sense. Ooh. Definitely no reason not to shoot when he gets close. No, because I can't hit him. He's not in my crosshairs. Because the things above me... Oh, see? Okay. The things above me are blocking me from moving backwards. Okay. So little. Uh, 
This boss requires a lot of patience, Atarius Maximus. Says. Yeah. Yeah, because he can't hit you on the side. So it's actually kind of a safe spot until Ugh. the thing moves up. Yeah, and that's well, annoying. Yeah, yeah but that thing's coming back up around again. Oh, that's so annoying. Get him! Shoot! No, I, I can't shoot him! He has to be in the right field. Like, I can't shoot him here. I'm gonna hit the thing at the top. Mm -hmm. It's patience. That's why I said you have to be patient. I'm being a back stick. Backseat joysticker. Yes, you are. <laughs> Maybe someday you'll play this game. <laughs> <laughs> I know I only played it on ease because I was only getting one missile at top coming after mm. me. Okay, that makes sense. Level five. Okay, we'll beat, you. beat ITC. You can do it. Get we'll to see. level nine. <laughs> this level, th this part doesn't seem to get harder, does it? Because there's those only the, one missile. I want to say that guy at the top. As long as you stay out of the way of that, he is yellow. faster now. But yeah, he's a bit faster. But that's almost better because he gets past you faster. Yeah, it's kind of like the last game. It's like, well, it's good to, to get it out of the way. But he does target you. I mean, true. So you do have to be careful. And the um, the medical truck d comes at the higher level now. So. Mm. Low. Low. Where are you? It's hiding. Hello. <laughs> it's like, yeah, you got it. <laughs> so. We. Tomorrow. Starting oh, yes. tomorrow. Yes. We start on our long journey of watching every single Scorsese film. Oh my goodness. How many are there? You've done I, the math? I, I haven't counted it up. Okay. <laughs> but well you, you take too put long them all in a schedule. So. I did put them all in a schedule. Um So tomorrow is um twelve hours of uh Scorsese. And it's day one out of eleven. Eleven days of movies. Eleven days. At about ten, ten hours a day. I mean, nine to ten. This one's a big one. you only wanted to do his early films. Yes. And then you decided that after, we would do all of them. After watching uh, Killers of the Flower Moon. Well, although awesome. I understand it, that's still a lot of films to do in one. Oh, yeah, in he's, one season. He's been <laughs> making film for sixty years, so, and he's quite fairly prolific. Oh, yeah. Um, but I, I tomorrow's a, a long day because I wanted to end on Taxi Driver. End on, on a really, really well-known film. Oh, you got it. Very silly. <laughs> oh, you're almost there. Over a hundred hours of films. Oh, somebody did the math. Uh, yeah, about a hundred hours of films. Over a hundred hours. Um, uh, I've I bought the ones that I really like or I think I'm going to oh. like. Whoa! This one comes up in the air. Okay. There you go. <laughs> get it! Get it! This one doesn't seem too bad. Because they never go all the way to the right of the side. Oh, this one might move to the side and then go up. That might be true. Yes, we always watch them in chronological order. Oh um, God, he's got a lot of... A lot of hit points. Oh boy, oh boy, I don't want to be here. Ah! So tomorrow... No! Oh no! <laughs> you come straight down, you gotta get I out thought I was out of the way, but I wasn't. He was, he was killing me the whole time. So let me look at my list here. Oh my goodness. So we're starting in 1959 and going to 1976. Uh, we do them in chronological order, oh. and I include, um, we, I usually do directors, and and I usually usually limit it to directing only, not just something they've written, because some sometimes the the writing doesn't come through, and it's this the directing is the strong thing. That's true. 
The only thing, the only one I did that with was Tarantino because he has a very strong writing voice. And you can really, really, really tell when it's a Tarantino film, even if he's only written it. Um, so I've got uh, how many features tomorrow? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven features tomorrow. That's a lot of time not playing games and giving treats to cats. Yeah, there'll be a little... Uh... Well, they get really cranky when we play games. <laughs> It's They're true. usually fine when we're not playing games. It's when we're in this room playing games. Oh, you're down to 35. Oof. Yeah, I was getting low because he had moved up and I thought I was in the corner, but he was he was getting me the whole time. Oh, and I was like, oh, no. no. I didn't why. realize right away that he was actually destroying my shield. So, oh, my goodness. Okay. So the big ones tomorrow are mean. Sorry, Vox. Hush. Um... <laughs> Mean Streets and uh, Taxi Driver and Alice doesn't live here anymore. Okay. I mean, there's other ones, but people haven't really heard of them. Mm -hmm. Boss Melting looks great. Yeah, every, yeah they, um, everything was done by Tyrus Maximus except for the music. So all the graphics and all the um, programming was done by Tyrus Maximus. So the graphics are really, really good. Especially the disintegration of the enemies and the people. Ah, don't shoot the oh, geez. rescue thing. It's the one thing you can't shoot. I know. At least it didn't take that much out of me. No, nine. And um, let me go over the, the different movie marathons we've done so far. And each one we've watched every single film by the director. Yes, that every was available one. at the time we did it, yes. Yeah, yeah. Ones that are, came out after. Like for Tarantino, um, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood wasn't out at the time. No, when we did the Tarantino. So we couldn't, couldn't watch that one. Ah! So, the movie marathons we've done are... Uh, we did a Mad Max one. That wasn't a director. No, just because we oh, like Mad we Max. We did Quentin, Quentin Tarantino first. Then we did Mad Max. We did all the ones up to the new one. Um, another one's coming out soon. Well, TV show. Uh, then we did John Carpenter. That was a big mixed bag. It was a... That the, describes it very well. It was the very... Good, the good were amazing, and the bad were atrocious. <laughs> like, it was the full <laughs> spectrum. Then we did Sc Stanley Kubrick, which was mostly amazing. Yeah. Uh, Darren Aronofsky, which was good. mostly good. Oh, it was all amazing. good. They were all great films. They all had depressing. something. Depressing films. Yes, very depressing. Oh, I wouldn't stay on the right-hand side. That's dangerous. Um, then we did, uh, went away from director. We did the Infernal Affair trilogy, which is not really a movie marathon. It's three movies. Excellent films. Excellent films. Excellent films. Yes. Um, then we did Lord of the Rings, 20th anniversary. Oh. Ah! Oh, not too bad. Just shooting hats at you. Avoid the bowler hats. <laughs> nice. Get them. Get them. There you go. Ah! Not too bad yet. Got a lot of life left. But he's got a lot of life too. Oh, he's hitting you. Watch out. Is he? Yep. Got to stay away from that. Stay far on the left of him. There you go. No penalty for targets lift, lift, leaving the screen, no. Oh, ITC's been watching a Ghibli film every night. That's cool. Nice. We've seen most of them. I think there's a couple we're still missing that we haven't seen yet. Oh, you're doing good. Then we did Paul Thomas Anderson. Which was good. Which was very, very good. Um, then we did uh, Man With No Name Trilogy and um, Akira Kurosawa's Yojimbo. Then we did the Safdie Brothers. Stay on the left. Almost got him. A little couple more hits. Woo! Yeah! Looks like 
looks a bit like an evil menorah. <laughs> evil <laughs> menorah is coming to get you. Beautiful golden uh, menorah drone. <laughs> yep. Tanya's going all the way. The Reaper. There's ten levels? Ten? Atarius Maximus? Is that true? Mm. One hit point should make the game... Much harder. Yeah, it would be. Yeah. You have to be perfect. Uh, yeah, we did the Safty Brothers, which was distressing. <laughs> excellent, 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 excellent filmmakers films. if you're looking for new or younger film uh, directors. Yeah, very fairly newish. Yeah, I, um, would, I would say new. Young. Yeah. yeah. Um, Everything is all about tension and anxiety. And people that are completely useless in their own lives. Uh, people who make decisions that you just go, no, don't do that. What are you doing? You crazy people. When there's a hundred good decisions and one terrible one, they'll go for the one terrible yeah. decision. Yeah. Every single the time. The choice is always <laughs> the, not the choice that any ah, reasonable, don't it. reasonable person would ever um, yeah. make. And uh, this year's uh, movie marathon is Martin Scorsese. It's going to take six months uh -huh. of watching every two to three weeks to get through it all. After you beat the tenth boss, you've beaten the game. However, I've left a level 11 in there that's <gasps> endless. Just try and increase oh. your score. Yeah, fair enough. Interesting. No Square. bomber. Odd. The bomber uh, is in blue color, right? A pretty darn large coming across the screen. Like it takes up about a quarter of the screen length. Ooh. What is this? That's um, missing? No, because well, this is easy. we're playing easy, so there's yeah. no bomber. But he's just, um, ITC's describing it. So we'll see it when I play. I'm going to play terribly because I'm going to play the hardest version. Yeah, do it. Yes. Level 8. We're almost there. Whoop. Warrior. Warrior. Okay. Oh. Oh my oh, god. Oh my goodness. Oh, what is that thing above? Don't touch it. Oh my goodness. This, okay, this is level eight is where we all die. I can see why this was the last level ITC. Oh, oh I'm not going over there. Whoa, that. those lasers hurt pretty bad. Do they? Yeah. Oh, perfect. Perfect. Stay exactly there. <sighs> Do not move. He can't hurt you. He can't hurt you there. <laughs> it's okay. It's all right. It's going to take It's just one hit point at a time. We'll be here for 500 hours. Oh boy, it does very slow. <laughs> it is very slow. Uh, yeah, you can take advantage of that when he stops. It would actually be safer on the left-hand side of the screen. I don't, I don't agree. Because that guy comes from the right. Yeah, but he only comes, he doesn't come this low, does he? I don't know. No, he, doesn't he, seem he's, to. He's, he just stays in one spot. That's why it's called easy level. <laughs> Its vision is based on movement, like a T-Rex, Kev says. Shoot. <laughs> Kev, we're having a movie marathon tomorrow. It's from noon to midnight, so <laughs> if you're available at any time during there, uh, come on by. I'm sure I've sent you the invite on Facebook. I'd have everyone in the chat over, but you don't live here. <laughs> at least I don't think so. Yeah. You almost got him. So I know. close. Just gonna hang out here. I'm I'm not against doing these kinds of tactics. Uh, and we went to a concert. Yes, we did. Last Saturday. Sunday. Sunday. Yeah, it ended early, so but it just didn't didn't end at two in the morning because it was on Sunday. Almost got him. It was for those. Of the of you who know these bands, yeah, I'm it, sure they do. <laughs> probably, you're the right age range. It may not be your genre. Yeah, woo! Kick off that warrior. Um, it was uh, Ministry. Everybody knows Gary Newman. That was the other band, and Frontline Assembly, which yes. you probably don't know. Yeah. But most people would know. Ministry, ministry for sure almost everyone knows gary newman because mm. he had a massive mm. massive radio hit with cars mm. um the concert was mind-blowingly it was good really good oh my god yeah. i've seen both ministry and gary newman before mm. and i was kind of not looking forward to it because they did not do give a very good show last time the i last saw time both you of saw them? them yeah 
this time. Oh my God, they were amazing. Just mm -hmm. in unbelievable. Yeah, it was a loaded set of people. Like all three are headliners. I've seen all three as headliners before. Wait a second, is this level eight again? Was oh, I, what? Wasn't that just level eight? I thought it was. Ah. I swear it was actually, because I was like going, oh, you're on the same levels that Ivory Tower Collections made it to. Uh, I'm on level eight again. Uh, level eight again. Level okay. Eight. So well, maybe ITC level eight. did made it much further than level Could eight. Have. <laughs> hmm. Uh, I see. Last concert I saw was Crystal Method played at a oh. bar here. Crystal Method has played here recently. Really? Or is coming up. I'm not too enthused about DJ sets. Uh, I like that genre of music. I know. From, but, it's uh, rave music. I like rave music. I like people who like DJ sets are okay, but I I'm more inclined to go to concerts where um, people are playing instruments or singing live or something like that. Um, so a lot of electronic music doesn't appeal to me. It's like, nope, nope. Thank you. He's scared. It's like, ah, oh, it's so dangerous around here. I didn't pass the next boss. Oh, not sure that counts as a concert. Um, a lot of people love going to just to, I guess, be in the... Pr I've never understood DJ sets. Really? Like you're in the presence of the person. No, it's the music you like and the they to press, dance. They press. I no. mean, they press a button in the concert. But usually their concerts, like they, they I, don't play exactly what they no, recorded. No, they do remixes and blah, 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 blah. so you get you get a lot. You get uniqueness. You get uniqueness out of it. I the think the thing you get is you're in the presence of the person who made the music. That's fine. You're in the presence of a bunch of other people who like the same person as you do, and you get loud music. That's good enough for a lot of people. It's not enough for me. I, I love loud music. Uh, I love loud music. And, and I don't usually consider there's, that a, live, there's quite a though. bit of spectacle involved too in those sets. Yeah. Like depending on yeah, the band. So true. I I think you're I think you're being a little too critical. I think you'd probably enjoy it. You'll you'd enjoy the show. I think. Nope. 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 I went to Justice. Yeah. And I love Justice. Yeah. And I went there and they were just on stage going play. Did, well, it depends on the on the artist too, right? It does. Some some do more and like play like keyboards, and it's like, oh, that's the keyboards. Actually, the concert like you're describing is when I saw Bella Fleck and the Flecktones a few years back. I'm not familiar with. Them. Oh boy. Oh, it's a stealthy one. Only lights up when you hit it. It's not too bad. Not too bad. Those things unlock across the bottom. This is like a repeat of the other one. A little bit. It's very similar. Yeah, very similar in, in the fact those things are moving very slow. I think you can be defeat this one. Get past it. It sucks when they're on the edges. I would say. Just play it safe. There you go. Now you can go back to your safe spot. Well, they're going to ah, come back around. You're very low on hit points. Don't take Am chances. I? Yes. You're very low. Don't take chances. You almost got them. No, but these guys come back around. Okay. Go high. Go high. Careful. Oh, you're down to almost nothing. Why am I down to almost nothing? Because you're getting hit by his lasers. His lasers? Yeah, you keep getting hit. How am I getting hit by his lasers? Because you keep moving in. You almost got him. Oh, that's my death. Oh, uh, what hit so you? Close. Oh! There's no lives. <laughs> no, no, there's just, there's no lives. So close. Excellent. Okay. <laughs> I No, I made it uh, to level eight. Yeah, that's how it went down. Uh, ITC, same. <laughs> Tanya was taking too many chances. I no, told I wasn't. Her not to. I wasn't. You she have was to hit him. In. You have to hit him. You're not paying attention to the stuff shooting across the ground. I have to move away from them. Nice. Anyway, I want to see you do expert. Let's see if you get past level one. Probably not. <laughs> Probably not. There were two dark gray planes in addition to the boss. You mean in oh. the sky? Oh, I must have missed them entirely. That's why. I didn't oh see God. them. This is... That's what gets you. This is very, it's the, it's, very it's, bad. It's the planes you can't see. Oh, my goodness. Nice. Oh, this is this is way cooler. This is chaos. Oh, and that, that laser thing moves. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my goodness. Okay. And it's that, the one at the bottom. Oh my god. And you lose your laser like instantly. <laughs> These are go low. Oh, it's low, not gone. Go. Oh my goodness. That oh, is... I can't hit anything. I haven't even moved the the needle. 
there's too it much is to, insane. There's too much to pay attention to. I missed the dark planes. Wait, so did I. That's why I we didn't were even going down. see them. But it, it could be our screen too. It's, it's, it's pretty dark. We're staring into the sun. We are, because we have all these lights here, so that doesn't help. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. I'm gonna blame the lights. Oh yeah. <laughs> all the bright lights in my eyes. I'm gonna have to stay on the top level. I've only moved the needle once. Oh my god. Ah. Yeah, Dan. Very cool. Love the speech. Love the speech. Oh, yes. Speech is oh, very Oh, your laser is like low after like two shots. It's total chaos. It is absolute it is chaos. chaos. There's so much to pay attention to. I'll be happy if I make it to the boss. Which. I don't. It's not happening. I'm your down to 13. Your shield is 13. Wow. Because that plane drops it up right on you. Oh no, it doesn't. Just a coincidence. Oh my god, did I get hit again? Mm -hmm. Five! No. Ah! Ah! I have to use all my bombs. Oh, I've got two left. Oh! What hit me? What hit me? Dead. No mega drones were defeated. Uh. Standard. Well, you played quite a bit, so we don't. Okay. And you can see what is uh, going on there. So I am going to do some. Actually, first we're going to take a look at the music player. Oh, cool. So. Oh, it's quite a bit quieter. Nice. I'm just gonna turn it up temporarily. The on you. Okay. So you can play all the tracks in the game. And there's 13 tracks. They're all at different volumes. <laughs> Um, I don't know. It's Pokey, PG <laughs> says. <laughs> nice graphic uh, dancing lights. Get the name of the tracks. So there's um, 13 tracks. The last one is the Atari intro. I like that. Oh, <laughs> it's an extended Atari song. Nice. That's awesome. That is awesome. Interlude. Fantastic music. Very good. And he's also included an extra game in here. I saw that. A drone bomber. Okay, are you now trying to bomb the drones? <laughs> You'll see. Oh my goodness. Nice. So this is a game that he was working on a long time ago. Okay. And he, nice. and he customized it for this game to include the graphics from... Uh, the running men in the, in the yeah, background there? Yeah, all the graphics and the boss at the top. No, sweetie. No. So it's Kaboom! Or Avalanche so if you want cute. to. Refer to it as its arcade version. But it's really Kaboom because Avalanche is quite different. <laughs> kitten! Which kitten is that? It oh is my god, the I survived. Cat. The gray cat. I can't believe I got that. Bad gray cat. He's like, I want more treats, please. I won. I want to win again. Do you want to win again? Yeah, you do. He's praying. He wants to win again. Can't wait. Oh, one of the bombs disappeared. There we go. So, so you can play that as a bonus game. Nice. But, oh, I have to stop. Oh, 
Oh no, there's lives. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> there's also a secret game. A secret game. And I can't show you how to get to it. Oh no, you're gonna. Can people see your I'm hands? Just... <gasps> I'm not. I'm gonna trick them. Thank you. Drone Patrol Boss Challenge! <laughs> Go for a high score by shooting the boss as many times as you can. Ah, nice. Just so boss. This is ju all boss all the time. All boss all the time. Nice. I like it's the big uh, the big uh, golden menorah boss. Yep. <laughs> it's great. So it's a little bit oh, different. Oh, it is, because it's... Sh yeah. And you, you only have... Your laser is very short. Very it gets short. scattered in the atmosphere. But you're able to very hold it down. down. Yes. You can go below the boss. Ah. Ah, no! <laughs> I almost killed myself by doing that. Oh, oh explosion! What's my score? Current score seven oh three. Was that my score? Oh, the yeah. seventy thousand's your score. In the game? Maybe. You didn't get very far. <laughs> or this game? Maybe seven oh three is this game? Oh yeah, definitely seven oh three. Yeah. So it takes the high score from the 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 main game. Well, that's going to be hard to keep track of. Okay. Your turn cool. to play this. This game? Yep. Yeah. Okay. So he shoots at you. My tactic was to sweep across because he's a little bit later than you at tracking you. So if you stay in one spot or on one side, he'll just volley the shots across. Oh, it's horrible. The high score is from the previous game play session. That's a bug. He uh, ran into me. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the high score is from the main game. Oh, it is. Okay. Which is like, that makes you're never sense. gonna get that high score in this game. <laughs> Good luck. Figure out a good tactic because he does track you. He doesn't anticipate where you are. It's just the way how he shoots. He really does sh ah. shoot for you. Ah, got, ah, a, got a better score. Explosion. One more try. Seven ninety six. Six. See if I can get a thousand. Ah. Just don't run into him ah. because he instantly kills you if you run into him. Ah. If he corners you. Yeah. So when he's going down, that's better than. Oh, my health. Yeah, that was you a bad ran into move. him. Yeah. You have to get so close. You do. That's that's the payoff, I guess. Seven health. No. No, Cut I didn't do well. Please. Easily fix that. Yeah, and, and have a have separate score for boss challenge, mm. a separate high score. Because yeah. really, you should only see the boss challenge high score when you're in here. Get me at all angles. Oh, you're getting destroyed. I was trying something yeah. new. I'm just gonna oh, die. Oh, getting destroyed. What hit me? Ready? It's so hard to avoid. It's it's when he goes over top of you is is the problem, right? That's the main. Yeah, if you problem. run directly into him, he'll just totally just. So it's best to wait till he's going health. down. But he's moving so fast. He goes too fast, yeah. So oh, your health's down to six. <laughs> and kaboom. <laughs> anyway, it's it's a fun extra game. It is a fun extra game. Um, all right. So I think we've explored all of that. I so, think we got um, yeah. Great job, Atarius Maximus. Yes. Oh, there it is again. Um, awesome job. Um, I like that. And I love <laughs> the intro <laughs> screen. Oh! Oh, it's party time! <laughs> Cats, cats, cats. Oh.
It's party time. Oh, sorry. Yeah, oh. I have it. Do we have um, coasters? Yeah. One or two. Oh, no, that's a new one. No, 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 no. <laughs> No, no. Nothing. The well-used posters. Okay. For them to slobber all over there. Okay. One for you, one for you. Sparkly zero-page coasters. A little bit of catnip for you. A little bit of catnip for you. There you there go. There you go, little kitties. Those are your catnip trays. Awesome game, Atari. Thank you, Vitoko, for giving the kitties yes, catnip. Yes, thank you. They're so and happy. And thank you, Atarius Maximus, for uh, letting us play your mm -hmm. game and uh, making this special screen for us. So here you go. Oh, thank you. Well, have a good night, have Nostalgic. A good night. Have Nostalgic. a wonderful Friday. Yep. Oh. You can catch the rest on YouTube. That's We've right. We've got one more game Already. left. And it's VHZC's updated Kitty uppers time. Kitty uppers. Night guy in another castle. Woo! So, kitties are rolling around. Let's load up the next one. Ooh, it's got a new intro. Our hero is trapped in a castle. He's he has no idea how we got there. Me neither, and I wrote the game. <laughs> the only thing he knows is that now he is in, in another, another castle. Castle. So okay. Three pixels wide by one, two, three, four, five, six. High? High? For three the by thought? six. That's like nice. minimum. I think you can do a three by five, but it's it's rough. Uh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Night guy in another castle. Demo five. Nice. So this is uh, from February 22nd, 2024. It was just before we did the Atari Homebrew Awards, so we haven't had a chance to play this yet. Finally yeah. got around to it. Um, 145K game. Last time we played was January 9th, 2024, uh, on Demo 3. So this is Demo 5. So the changes that have been made, another area and another boss has been added, several cosmetic changes, that's Demo 4, and on Demo 5, remember the floor falls, yep. uh, Demo 5 cosmetic changes and some changes in the rooms order. So really there's an extra boss that we're going to see. Got the sword now. It's good they give it to you early. I know. You need it early. <laughs> it's kind of just like, yeah, here's a, a thing to do, get the sword. Should have stayed at the top. Really? Yep. Because you oh. have to go go to the top to get to the next part. Oh, do it's you? It's not, not a problem. Isn't there stuff down here? I haven't gone this way. Uh, There is, but you don't go there yet. Not yet. You have to go push a button along the top. Oh, Atari, you're just full of catnip all over you. Both of you cats are just... Covered in catnip. My They're God. Silly kitties. You're both so silly. Oh. Uh oh. I hate, I hate it when stuff like that happens. You'll get more lives later. So we've played this, I think, it, it, two times in the show already. So we've seen a lot of these screens, but he says he's put them in a different order, so we might see some changes. Mm. Avoid the pointy bits. Thank you, Carl G. <laughs> pro the, tips. Those pro tips pro from the, tips from the from chat. ZPH's oh. chat. Yes. It's always super, super helpful. <laughs> pointy bits are bad. Except the pointy bit that you're carrying in your hand. Correct. <laughs> Can I get back down here? No. Uh, Darcy did it once. Oh, oh, careful. Darcy did it once. I've never seen it replicated again. Oh, man, this oh, is not good. Oh, you're going to die so quick. He somehow slid underneath that. I don't know how he did it. You can fall off the ladder. It's faster. Yeah. Oh, I'm going to die. It's going to be a short game. <laughs> it is going to be a short game. Pointy bits, I think, are what VHC calls anti-CB uh, traps. What? Oh! <laughs> when you get too close, that's what I find this... Oh, again. <laughs> are you done? That you was do it again? too easy. No, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to have to run out for a second, so I'll let you, okay. I'll let you play. You'll get much further than that. We'll see. Did. Much further. Okay. Do it. Oh, 
Oh my god. Nobody saw anything. Nobody saw anything. Just starting my first game. That was sad and pathetic. Rage reset on the second screen. Terrible. Absolutely terrible. Let's get that sword again. Rage reset. Did I add in a rage reset uh, trigger? I think I did. I can't remember. I did add a new one today. think anybody's found it yet. Of course, it's very sp specific. I wouldn't do it now. Could have been used when Tanya was playing uh, Drone Patrol. She did have a good game. Coffee, welcome. Three stream streak. Oh, you got a bonus. 350. You can do, use that for cat betting. ITC, what was your number that you had left when you were playing this? I think it was like a thousand something. That's really good. I should go under 2121. 2121? Wow. Starts at 28. That's that's really good. Oh, this is new. Neat. Wow, nice. That so is there nice. are some changes. Boss time. It's boss time. Cute. They are. They're adorable. Adorable like black fluffy kittens covered in catnip. Oh, so adorable. The treat ball is loose. The treat ball's Ooh, loose. Oh, Crypto Coffee 13. I'm going to give him the treat ball? I will, but I don't. Okay. Start shaking up the treats. The other cats come running. And oh, here he is. the cats. Let's switch over to the kitties for this. All right, let's get you. Thank you, Crypto oh, Coffee. That's awesome. Thank you for the bits. Thank you for the bits, too. These cats appreciate it so much. They love you now. Yes. They're giving you lots of food love. They're 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 <laughs> reciting your name in, in their heads and saying, meow, meow, thank you. Thank yeah. you, Crypto Coffee. Thank you, Crypto Coffee. An enemy health bar would be handy for bosses. Well, games games do one or the other. One Stay is like, here. well, you don't know. And the other is you do know. No, no, I'm moving these out and, of the way. And, you know, each has their own. Okay. Let's see if I can keep this somewhat contained. Probably not. Okay, there you go. The cat ball has been released. The cat ball has been released. Tree ball. It's a cat ball. It's a cat ball. Okay. I assume that's... Uh, oh. Get it back. I wonder if there's a way... <laughs> we have to find a way to contain it. I know. Do we have a... I can't remember if I go this way or not first. So you have to watch... Let's forget. Sprite, if you can. Because he's kind of hilarious. He pushes the ball with his nose in a oh, straight it's line. It's adorable. He has the best ball handling skills I've ever seen in a cat. He needs to play... Uh, football. Can you knock some over? Don't put it under there. Ooh, I should go the other way first. Because that's a heart, and I may die. Whoa, duh, like there. Damn it. This is going to be tight. There we go. Stupid, 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 stupid. Atari is hyper-focused on the ball. 
Sprite finds it a little bit too chaotic, I think. Oh, this area is so big. Are they coming out? Let me make it a little wider for you. I think Sprite is just Oh my high. god! Oh! He doesn't want to hit the ball, but he's willing to get the treats once they escape. Of course. Naughty cats. Have you played Atari today? Oh. <laughs> oh, this balloon part. I remember this. I have to memorize. I have to remember where all the things are. Oh! Sorry, I have to go around the other way. Go to the middle, then I go over to the left. Oh my god. Damn it. Need an arena like it like uh need an arena for it like those Beyblades toys from a few yes. years back. Exactly. Oh my god. I need we need to just create a little a little like box for them that we can put down for yeah. With high edges. With high edges, like oh oh so sorry. I'm so sorry. Just smacked Atari in the face with a ball. Uh, sorry, Kitty. Don't smack cat ball kitties. arena says I am the cat ball arena guy. <laughs> <laughs> the more the merrier. That's there right. you go. <laughs> yeah. Atari smacks the ball with his paw. Um Sprite pushes the ball with his nose. Different tactics. Very different tactics. with branching areas. Oh, boss time. It's boss time. Oh, so cute. Looks like one of those um, Pokemons. <laughs> no. Oh, no. He dissolves in water. How is that possible? Now I know what I was doing before. It's not a hard boss, you just have to memorize the pattern. This takes a bit of patience and time. Yeah, Yay! this one's this one boss is about patience. Da -da -da. Hearts for me! Yay! Get those hearts! Seven! Yay! Oh foreboding swan at the bottom there. The water seal has been broken. Hi. She's missing one on the floor there. Is that noise? I guess that's a waterfall noise? Yeah, it's a waterfall. Ah. Now why is there... Oh, now I remember. Go over top of them? Mm -hmm. Yeah. If they jump from there, yeah, that makes sense. Do, 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 do. I think you can Such walk mean across corpuses. But, but when you get to the left, you can't get up here. That's the thing. Here. Now what I think now I go up here. I think I did Oh, I can't remember what's up above there. Hmm. Oh boy. This is all new now. Yeah? Yeah. Do you think you go left or right? I'm gonna go right first. Nope. Oh. Nope. Ooh. Yep. Let's do it. Oof. Let's do it. Good job. Well, this isn't I remember this area. We've yeah. Been, we've done this. Yeah. I don't think we've gone up the ladder. Oh, okay. Just come all the way down here? No. So it's there. One, the two. two, and then a break. Yeah. I think you just go here and get the, the green heart. Yeah. The cats are still after the ball. How many did you put in there? A few. 
Probably more than they needed, but that's okay. I got the green heart. I don't know what that was for. Can you go above that guy? Oh, back? Yeah. There? Oh, over? yeah, you or can. Or kill him? I don't know. Oh, yes, you can. Alright. I just have to hit that and run over. Run! Fall! Oh my god, this is new. No, it's not. Is it? Oh yeah, I have to... Hit the buttons. You have to hit the button on the other side. And shoot it. I remember this one. Oh ah! my god. Oh, it's the thing at the top. Yes. Oh, this is where I died, I think, last time. It just, it just does the angle, too. So you're safe. You're safe there. <gasps> just don't run too soon. <laughs> Oh, God. oh. Duh! <laughs> this is hard. Sounds like there are any left. Good job, kitties. Thank you, Crypto Coffee. Happy cats. God damn it. Not a happy James. No. <laughs> Very unhappy. But happy cats. All right, have a good night, Atarius Maximus. Thank you so much you for can't sharing walk your under game. It. Yeah, so thank much you fun. so much. You have to jump over it. Oh my god. Oh, good job. Oh, I need some hearts real bad. There's going to be a heart there. Seven, please. Oh. Nine, please. Nine. Nine works. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Burning through lives quickly, says Carl G. Yeah, that was very fire seal. Woo! Guessing there's one more. Good job, good job. I feel like I'm like... Oh, <laughs> feel like there's one more oh no there's nothing up there looks like there would be but there is not oh he's permanently dead it's gone hmm. cap all arenas is 7800 sure is a lot of great things happening oh yeah it's a great, great system to have left, right? yeah. great system to have nowadays just barely made it. Not just so I haven't been left. No, not yet. Oh, guess I should check it out at yeah. least. Oh, smooshies. Or not. Maybe if I'm not dumb about it. Uh, nope. <laughs> no. Uh, can no. you jump that? No. You don't think so? No. Maybe you that's fall not. from the top on the left, maybe? No, that's not good. Oh, it's just those between those two. Is it? Yeah. Oh, okay. Oof, 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 oof. Cat wants out. You want out? Well, he wants a door open. He doesn't want out. And I don't have what this wants. Oh, no. Oh, okay, that's the end. Probably the left then. Oh, the end, yeah. Can okay. Fall to the left? Or is that bad? No, it's just there. So you must have to jump then. Yeah. Oof. Do you think? Yeah, I think so. <sighs> nice. Whoa. Whoa, baddie. You get stabbed and he's going to come oh, back. Oh, he comes <gasps> back. Like in Mario, like in Super Mario. Nice. Bones, Bones Brothers, Bones, Bonesy, Bones. <laughs> What's his name? <laughs> I can't remember. <gasps> Look at that. Ooh. Ooh. That looks really nice. That is super. It's really smooth. Mario. Wow. <laughs> That's not uh, one of those rubber playground balls. Oh my. No. Uh, looks harder than it is. Some things look like, oh my god, I'm gonna die. Okay, this, these move up. <gasps> and that kills you at the top. Yep. Oh boy. You're gonna have to jump sec between. <gasps> the second one doesn't kill me. No. It's just the first one. Oh, it's, uh, it's slow. platform I have to cross. Oh, spear guy. I can't stab him. He will stab me. Whoa. That was close. You have had so many treats. <laughs> more. You have so many treats. No more. Your belly is oh. your belly is full of my treats. Head. Yes. No, it's not. Oh, I want more. I, my belly's, there's room in my leg for more treats. <laughs> uh, 
Dry bones. Dry bones. Something bones. Whoa, that was very close. Mm -hmm. I didn't realize the ceiling was that low. Okay. Oh, you have to jump to the right, obviously. And that's a bouncer. I have to push it over a little bit. And I get teleported. Oh. Okay. And there's only one thing to do in this. TNT. Now do I... Well, it's an arrow over there, so I'm going to be pushing it over here and then pushing the other button. And it'll blow it up. I know what you're about, VHZC. <laughs> oh. <gasps> Final boss. Or a boss. Uh-oh. Oh, <gasps> well... You have to I run did, into him. I did jump at least. That's good. Okay. Oh, oh, so I can't stab him too many times. Oh my god. That's it. Yeah. Just stab One, him two, three. Stab One, two, him three. a little bit. Not too much. Little stabbies. Yeah. Not, not big stabbies. Yeah. DC has a tip. Yeah, for this guy? Not this guy. Oh. In general? He said the TNT later? works on the other wall too. Oh, okay. I just didn't want to extra distract life. you while you were Ex doing this. Extra lives on the other side, I'm guessing. Uh, hopefully. So Probably lives on the right here too. Oh, there would be. Yeah. yeah. Usually. Yep, 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 yep. Or something. No, it's the key. An, uh, Usually you get heart. Oh, don't you? Seal. The last seal has been broken. I believe I have to go way, 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 way back. Yeah, but try to blow up the other side and see if there's hearts there, because you need hearts. That's a good idea. Thank you, ITC. Actually, that's probably how you get out. No, no that's a teleporter. Is this it? is oh, definitely hearts. There you go. Yay, hearts! Thank you, ITC. Woo! No air seal. No stone. Well, that's earth. What were they? There was wind, fire, water, water, and stone. Stone. So, so earth. Yeah. Yeah. So no air. Well, wind. There's wind. Mm. Don't jump on. This too, one then. is a little tricky. <laughs> Not too bad. A little tricky. No. So we oh. figure up. Uh, no. The end? Um, it may, but I, I swear there was four doors at the beginning of the game somewhere oh. on a path I didn't take yet, but I'm going to go up anyway, mm. just, just to see. Because it's not that far to go up. <gasps> ah, slippery. You need the key mm. from opening the four doors. So I have to go back. Yeah. Yeah, back towards the start. Yeah. yeah. I think James figured that out, but yeah. Yeah, because I remember the doors. I didn't see them in this playthrough. I think it's this way and up Above? there. Above? Yeah. Sweet cat. Very magnetic. Sweet cat. Come on. <gasps> Came back. Beginning? It's near it. Oh, I can't click that. Yeah, that's it is nearish the beginning. Sweetie. Poor kitten. I know. It's such a hard life. Now, is it up here, I think? Hey, VHZC! Hey, made it! I'm almost done. I've opened the four seals. We're trying to find the doors. We're probably heading going the wrong to, way. Heading to the doors. I think it's up here. Yep, there it is. There's the four doors open. I get the key, and then I head back to where I was. Gotcha. Made it just for the ending. Yay! Surprised to find you still here. It's almost 2 a.m. Oh, oh yes. yeah. No, cute little kitten. Yeah. 
Yeah, it's a it's not super long stream. We're nearing three hours, but um, I, I that's want, pretty normal. Wanted to do a a because we had pretty three pretty big games that I wanted to Very get. Very fun games. Fairly far. I have to go around. How do I get up there again? I think I have to go around somewhere. Oh, what? Did I go past something I shouldn't have? Um, I think I... Because you, you came down, so... I think maybe I'd, you had to go to the right at the top there. Oh, yeah. When you came down. Oh, yeah, that's okay. It's okay. Ah, my head. Ah, my head. Go to the right. Yeah. Cross all this. Ah, Fidelco. Prepare making a ten liner uh, game. Uh, some of those words I know. <laughs> that sound, look like English words. All I get is ten liner. I got ten liner from that. <laughs> well, pre presenting a ten liner. Yeah, something about make uh, make a ten liner. <laughs> That's all I got. <laughs> probably, now is it to the right? Oh, don't. It's it's a boomerang. It comes back. I can't remember which way it is. Oh, I might as well get that. Um, Is it back? Well, it's obviously to the right, because this is the left. Ten hearts! Um, yes! Is it up through that? No, that's where I came from. Don't you have to go back? I just came from there. Oh. You have to get to the top there somehow. Yes, it is... Up? To the right. So that's where I went. Yeah, now, that's it. Now the doors and will... Up and up and up and I up I have the key now. And just don't get... And da, 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 almost done. Woo! That was much slower than ITC. Oh, is there a final boss? Final boss. Oh, no! Yay! Yay! Ten lives! <laughs> Good times. Your turn. No. No. <laughs> 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 awesome, awesome game, VHZC. Um, so much fun. Hola, VHZC. Como estas? <laughs> um, is is this not the final boss yet? So that needs to be okay. added. Um, is that what is the only thing that kind of needs to be added onto this? Is the final boss? Because it looks like you get the four things, you get the key, and then this is the 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 waiting for the final boss to be added in yeah pseudo graphics 5 48 a.m whoa what are you oh. doing up at least it's a weekend i guess <laughs> i guess so did you get up early or did you stay up late that's crazy <laughs> um excellent vhzc mm -hmm. um really great puzzles and obstacles and yeah, yeah so much going on in that one that's for sure great set of games thanks for tuning in for cs to win VHZC. Such a, yeah wonderful set of games today um i was really really impressed i think we're both impressed by the swinging um now what are the official names of those if it's it like was a, a like morning star morning star yeah. yeah 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 they're really smooth the movement yeah. and the um the circular movement of, of it of and the, the chain, chain as it. well yeah that the looks mace amazing. yes yeah well it depends if there's space up the final boss of coded i could add a couple more screens gotcha nice yeah yeah so it's nearing completion. Spike ball pendulum. Spike ball pendulum. <laughs> Could be called that as well. Yeah. Great game, game Vlad, and I'll probably never get to the finish. It's not too bad, Dan. It's not too bad. Yeah. He, he's very generous with the hearts, which yes. is nice. Yeah. And I, I think he said before that he likes to make games that are simple enough for his kids to play. Yeah. So that, that they can have fun as well playing playing the game. So. Yeah. It's it's a nice it strikes a nice balance, VH said C games. You can have a game that's hard, but as long as it's forgiving and you get enough hearts to get yourself to the end, then you can you can see yourself yes. to the end of the game. Yeah. I mean yeah. I was getting low at points. Yeah. <laughs> so it was like uh, but I was making kind of silly mistakes. Yeah. Yeah. And that it's slide like... trick you saw Darcy do, yep, it's totally possible, but doesn't save much time for the risk. Mm. Yeah, I don't Darcy somehow just went phew, Right through? S slipped right between that, <laughs> yeah. So, uh, let's uh, give a little summary okay. of all the games. So, Stone Age. Fantastic, beautiful graphics. Great 
Converse Any game with a T-Rex is fine by me. Um, the animations. Yeah, animations, even from the volcano in the background to the pterodactyl and the, the Baby little dinosaurs. cavemen. All of it is just looked fantastic. Yeah, it's come so far from its first incarnation and it's getting really close to be finished. So, yeah. And the gameplay ramps up. Yes. At a good pace. It's simple enough to pick it up fast and, and it gets hard quickly, you yeah. know, a couple of rounds. So, yeah. No, Highly excellent. Yeah. Beautiful game. Beautiful game. Yeah. Drone Patrol. Oh, amazing. Yeah. Well, we played uh, it on, you played on easy. You got to level eight. Eight, yeah. Um, and then I played it on expert and I didn't even get it to the boss. <laughs> yes. So you got the whole range there. So it's got a lot. I think that's lot, really good, actually. It's got a lot going on. Very creative bosses. You can ramp your way up in difficulty and get yes. used to the, the higher levels of complexity where you, your brain just can't take it all in after a while. But yeah, it's amazing. Great music, great graphics, oh, a lot of bonus gorgeous hidden music. features yeah. and got a music player in there. Yes, yes. Um, reminiscent of 2600's Raptor, which is a good thing. Mm. That That is an amazing game. Mm -hmm. Highly recommended if you like shooter games, I guess. And there's a lot of, a lot going on on the screen. So mm -hmm. uh, very recommended. It's a really good game. Uh, Night Guy in another castle for the 7800 VHZ. What can I say? <laughs> does, does it again. He's very close Amazing. to being finished. So yep. this one's almost done. Another wonderful platformer. Yeah, the graphics are astounding. The in the VHZ animations ZZ astounding. universe. Yes. Uh, in the Night Guy universe. Fantastic. And such diversity in all the screens. Yes. Like, yeah. It's and it's not so long that it takes too long. So you don't need to save or anything. Mm -hmm. Um. And you're never bored. Every screen is a different challenge. So you have yes. to be prepared for anything when you enter a screen. A little bit of backtracking, a little bit of branching, but not too much. Very easy to handle. Um, yeah. Amazing graphics as well. Such fun gameplay. If you like platformers, yeah. you will love Night Guy in Another Castle. Yeah, absolutely. So, wow. Great triple header there for 7800 games uh, wonderful yeah. all three are all bangers as they as the young kids say nowadays <laughs> as all the kids fan, say. As, as those kids say nothing mid all good all good <laughs> um, so let's uh, take a look at what's coming up on the show so uh yeah we played three games today next episode it might be a 2600 I, I know I want to leave Pong Wars to an early show, but we've been not been able to do early shows because erlen has been sick and yep. complications. Um, Lots of because, complications. But uh, Thomas Yench, he likes to be able to see, be there for when I play the game. Yeah. So that'll be an early show. But we're going to be playing Plan B Escape Earth, uh, Bruce Lee. Uh, that's progressing quite nicely. Chaotic Grills oh, had nice. an update. Excellent. So I'm looking forward to playing that. Oh, Stellar Drive Mars. Day. Yeah. Um, but those might be bumped to the 15th okay. or they might be on the 12th. I don't know. Pong Wars will not be on the 12th. So we might have two 2600 days. I don't know. Yeah. Um, my Atari 8-bit has gone crazy again. Hooray. Oh, no. Color-wise. Yep. It's yeah. done that yellow thing again. Oh, no. So I have to take it apart. So uh, I don't know. I'm pretty busy this weekend. So it most likely will be 2600 games. And then another set of twenty six hundred games, but if, we'll see. If I walk around with with my um, uh, my slides on and pick up a charge and zap it, would that help it at all, or would that just make it worse? Probably worse. Okay. Probably not better. <laughs> <laughs> any better? It's not, it's not one of those. Has things, the color changed? It's not one of those things where you could say, "Well, it won't make it any worse." No, no, it could. It could. Okay. Yeah. No zapping, please. All right. Um, there's I'll, an after I'll dark we need to do because yeah. there's a uh, Lynx High Score Club Round Two of Scooternia, okay. nice. which is a challenging game. <laughs> You're on your scooter jumping over cars and old ladies. Remember that one? Oh yeah. 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 It's yeah, challenging. That's a funny game. Yeah. So that'll be like that'll it. be a lot of fun. So we're gonna play Good that stuff. probably next week at some point. I'll be continuing with my programming exercise. Oh, I'm so excited! My game. I'm so excited. It's not exercise. I'm making a game. Yes. Um, excited for that release whenever it comes. I know yep. it's still a ways away, but so. oh, not too bad. Yeah, it'll be done before the end of the month, I think. You it, think so? The first iteration. Oh, good. Yep. Yeah. Um, so it is a port of a game, um, and I'll make an alternative version. Yes, fair enough. So that, you know, it doesn't infringe on anything, <laughs> but there will be an infringy version. <laughs> uh, 
yeah, round one in fringy version. Yeah. In, in, in fringy version, round but it, two. But it's not the big end, so it's not. Sprites. So <laughs> you don't have to worry about that kind. Of, like you can't yeah. even release those types of games. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. They get they get mad. <laughs> Um, we got developer spotlight and Steve Englehart coming up. Mm. We made Drone Patrol and a billion other games. Mm. So there's going to be a lot to discuss awesome, awesome, awesome. on that one. I think he's already gone to bed. Oh yeah, uh, well, a little bit earlier. It is late. It is late. Um, we're. I want to do probably two rounds of basic ten liner contest. Um, I'll probably do a round as soon as my Atari Eight Bits fixed, because mm. Vitoko has at least two entries. He might do more. Um, but it's the deadline's coming up pretty soon for the entries being done. I think it's days away. Mm. Um, and then the judging takes a while, and it's not till April that the judging is done. Uh, we also have a secret homebrew from Champ Games coming up in May. Don't know what that is. He hinted at a dual joystick port. Mm. And uh, I'm sure somebody can find a, a list of all the dual joystick games in the arcade. Oh, that's true. Hmm. Next weekend is the ten liners deadline. Oh, okay. so there'll be some ten liners coming our way sometime soon. Yep. Oh, Excellent. there are some released already, so we can play them already. Oh, good. Just I don't have my Atari eight bit, and it oh. won't get fixed on the weekend because I'm busy all weekend. Uh, so it'll yeah, be... it'll take a little longer to get that up and running. Yeah, so I don't know yeah. when that'll happen. Seven, uh, seven eight hundred fortieth anniversary coming up in May as well. Um, three after darks for that. We're going to do a developer spotlight on Lawrence Stavely from Reboot. We've got a lot to play with him. Okay, um, excellent. On the Jaguar. And uh, we're doing a developer spotlight on Chris Walton. Um, probably coincide that with either Boom mm -hmm. or Xevious. Um, so both are in the works for him. Um, so that will be fun as well. Three developer spotlight this year. I don't think I'll do any more because they take a lot of research and... Mm. It's a lot to do. Well, you need to get all your questions ready. So. Crazy yeah. Climber. Yeah. Um, not intimately familiar with Space Dungeon. Cloak and Dagger. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Dual. Black Widow. Oh, my God. There's no way he did Black Widow for the 2600. <laughs> There's just, the web is so would be very challenging. Not impossible. You could do a little staggered, but doing the rings... He could do it with Playfield, maybe. Mm. He might be able to... That, oh, I'd love Black Widow. <laughs> oh, that would be the ultimate. Wow. Kicks couldn't be done. Nope. Neither could Galaga. Very yep. true. Neither Very could true. Robotron. He, those are all impossible He finds a do. way. Somehow he, he finds a way. He does find a yeah. way. Black Widow. Mm. Yes, that would be uh, high on my list. That's such a great game. Mm -hmm. Um... So, uh, lots to look forward to coming up. Oh, I never brightened the camera. Oh, well, do it next time. Um, so, thanks for hanging out with us for this fun episode. It was a good time. It was. I'm glad I'm feeling better today. Yep. I'm glad I got a oh, show goodness. in this week. I would have had to do, happy. do it on my own again. Oh, no. Mm, no. So sad. Just no. me and the kitties. No. Tempest. Oh, that one's, <sighs> that one's, I think, harder than Black Widow to do. Mm. Yeah. Um, yeah, the community keeps pumping out. Just amazing games. Astounding There's games. always more games to play. Always. Always more like, games. To never, play. never ending. It's yeah, absolutely amazing. It's awesome. Yeah. Um, thank you, Soda Graphics, Dan FC, Double Down, Vitoko, Ivory Tower Collections, Crypto Coffee, VHZC. Thank you so much for making that awesome game. Looking forward to playing it again when it's finished. That's yes. probably when we'll play it next because it sounds like it's really close. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can't wait to play it when it's done. Um who else in the list? Cat Ball Arena. Cat Ball Arena. Huge ass. Huge ass. Um, Crunchy the Clown. Nostalgic. Atari's Maximus. Yes. Thank yeah. you so Thank you much for, for making that game and doing this special intro, ZPH intro, yeah. just for us tonight. Drone Patrol. D Drone, Drone Patrol. Patrol? Drone Patrol. Drone Patrol. Yeah. yeah the game. Uh, it's Kev. Yeah. Um, oh. Oh, he he did respond to my question. We'd love to go busy weekend. Yeah. Uh, next time. Yeah. We'll have more, more, more next time. Many, many more. And everybody else Yay. who was lurking. Oh, VHSC says thanks, guys, for playing my game once again. Anytime. Always happy. Oh my god. Always happy to play. Always <laughs> so much fun playing your games. Yeah. They're so amazing. Awesome. Um. So that's it for us. Yes. Have a great weekend, everyone. Yes. We'll be back on Tuesday with even more awesome new games. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, it's probably overdue for a visit again. Yeah, definitely. Um, we're going to have those um, Martin Scorsese Film Festival for the next f six months. So welcome <laughs> anytime during that or even yeah. other times. Um, yeah. It'd actually be great to get you on the show. Yeah. Kev, if you want to do that. Yeah. Um, usually Tuesdays at noon and... But oh, Tuesdays can, at night, or I can make a separate show. You can you can do a weekend show too if, oh, if yeah. that's convenient. So, so uh, be in touch. Yeah, and uh, so we'll uh, see everybody yeah. on Tuesday. Have a great weekend, and uh, see you then. Yeah. Okay.